How does it feel like to spend so much time, de- like so much of your life dedicated to fucking YouTube? Fucking great. <laughs> and, uh, and then you just like on a whim, eh, I'll do TikTok and it I just know, like right? surpasses it everything. Yeah. It sucks. It says more about the audience than anything, I think. It's one of those things. It is, in fact, one of those things. All right. Did you ever put the left one on the right one? Uh, Like, on purpose? Yeah. No, I can't say that I do, sir. Um, <sighs> right. I'm not entirely sure why someone would. I but wore my best Daniel shirt. Do you, uh, do you recommend it? Dude, I was just thinking about my Thanos shirt. I don't even remember. What mm. you, said. you don't remember the conversation that no, was taking place no seconds idea. ago is what you're saying? <laughs> I have no idea. I was just thinking about the shirt. I was like, this is a badass shirt. <laughs> like, it's the first time you've seen it? Because it? it was under my, it was it was like the, the one, because I usually recycle the shirts. Yeah. So this, I, I tried doing this thing where it's like, okay, I usually wear these shirts on top. Let me just put them at the bottom. So I don't wear them for a, a oh, while. Oh, you mean like in your closet or whatever? Yeah. I, I got you. Wow, oh, interesting. I, like, nah, I gotta wear this shirt because this is the only one that's like feels good. Yeah. Are you organized like that? Yeah. Like no, I think I don't. I think since the quarantine happened, I started getting more organized. Okay. Slightly. Well, and why is that? Do you think just more time to to spend um, doing that shit? It was more of a. Um, Okay, when I'm done with this, then I'll do it. And then finally I'm done with it. So I'm like, okay, I'll do it. Mm, I got you. But then re- recently I was kind of like, okay, I'm never going to be done with this thing. <laughs> like this thing. I yeah. should just fucking do it. And then I did it like in a day. Yeah. Now I feel good. Yeah. Well, good. I feel good. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm big on like organization. It's the only way I was going to say it's the only way I stay happy. But I'm also not. So maybe I should just not worry about being organized. Mm. Um. It's useless, is what I'm getting at. <laughs> Drinking beer with my friends Drinking on a Thursday with afternoon. My with my friends. On my Sinatra <laughs> shit. Thank you for being here. Of course. Of course, Evan buddy. Fucking, um, of course, buddy. When's the last time I saw you? Um, Probably at my house when you just come to. Yeah, I took your. I took the. Borrow things? I took the. <laughs> <laughs> I took your uh, fuck. What was it? I don't know. Your fucking thing. Fucking took, you know, parabola. What, what, do you call, what, yeah. what do you call those things? Parabola. Parabo- no parabola. No fuck. What was it? No I get, softbox. I just, yeah, I just, softbox. I just, I there you go. I gotta tell you, yeah. for two professional photographers, we really don't know a whole lot about no, photography. Not the words. I know the yeah, things exactly. But exactly. I, the words. I have fucking no clue. Yeah, that's something I've always known about you. And the only reason I know the right. words is because I'm fucking obsessive uh, to the point where I'll True. I'll like um, I'll stop myself from progressing because like well I don't know 100 percent of the words yet so like why even go do it and you you're kind of like the exact opposite we're yep. just like throw yourself into the fire yeah. and let's learn it as we go which I, is tight yeah I, I run and I forget <laughs> <laughs> I forget to fucking look at the signs I'm like, oh, it's right. okay. yeah later on when you you have to like sit me down and be like this is why this is. Really, yeah. like, techn- yeah. explain the technical, the technical aspects of it. Term is this? I'm like, oh, okay, I'll fi- yeah. figure it out later. But I yeah, feel I like know, you've like, done f- focal lengths. That's the one for me. Like, I had no idea this was this way because of this, and then I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, now I, I got it. you. As far as um, just what different looks you generate mm-hmm. based on the focal length, mm-hmm. I got you. Why is the camera frozen? Look at, look at, we're frozen. Am I? No, I mean we're both frozen. Am I? I don't like it. Am I? I don't like it. Yeah, I'm gonna man. start. I'm gonna stop and start again. Yeah, I just recently now. like used this, um, and I had the same problem. You recently used what? I recently <clears throat> used the app just to like to film oh, myself. Oh, this the remote? Yeah. yeah, I was filming uh, an unboxing video, so okay. I like propped it up for here. Yeah, and then I figured it out, and I was like, oh, okay, cool. Does it lag? Um, no, but I think if like if I move this way, it's like one, two, three, bam, like then it goes. Oh, so yeah, just maybe slightly. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. then I had the frozen thing, but other than that, it's pretty. Um, it's pretty good. Yeah, I, I like mostly it. just use this to stop heard, and start. Yeah, you know? it's a good. It's smart as fuck. I didn't even think about that. I use. I would think I'd use it more for playback for like filming videos or something. Right. Someone else wants to see. Oh, that's a good point too. Like if um, actually, I never thought of that. Like if you're doing a story or something. Yeah. And so the artist is there trying to see like trying to help or whatever in any way right he'll just watch it while i'm filming or something he's like oh, okay there that's good yeah can move on do you like when clients for lack of a better description uh throw in their two cents or do you kind of are you more 
I mean, we've worked together, but right. I'm also, so I kind of know how you are, right, but like right. someone who's listening you have might to not. Say, you have to do these questions I'm like, you fucking know, what do you mean? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> like, exactly. What are you talking about? Exactly. Like, right, what, right. I, like generally, yeah. do you like when uh, a client is over your shoulder? Like, what if we do this? What if we do this? Or are you more like, I just, I got if it's, it. Trust if me, it's, I got if it. If it's a good idea, like, yeah, it's it's fine. How but often if it's like are a, they good ideas? <laughs> <laughs> not that often. Um, yeah, yeah. But it's really like... um. It really depends on the video, I guess. Mm -hmm. If like I have no idea and you don't tell me or um, give me any type of like preparation way beforehand, sure. and then all of a sudden we're there when we're like, um, and then I'm very like that though. Like um, even if with no preparation, I, I could kind of go with it and mm -hmm. kind of do my own thing. But yeah. if you're, yeah, yeah, if like if it's like an idea that I had and we're going with it and it's my thing. Mm -hmm. Then they kind of come in and be like, no, how come he doesn't come through here or something or like something small yeah. like that? And it's like, like, no, you can't because like, you know, it just it's not. No, I'm already having to say too many words. <laughs> like, it's like, why no, am I it explaining? Work. Yeah. It's yeah. like if you're it's like if, if uh, you know, like a movie or something. And so, yeah, like, let's say for the example, um, we're filming in the daylight and mm. it's all the mo the movie is all in the daylight. And then he's like, I pictured this night scene. And I'm like, no, no, no. Like, <laughs> like, like you have no, you are not talking about the nighttime at all. Like, this right. is a sunny fucking beach video or whatever. Fuck. Yeah. You yeah. are not talking about the fuck, a fucking alley shot nighttime scene. Like, that's right. In that regards, I'm like, no. But in other regards, yeah. Yeah. It helps. It's okay. Sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes. Do, do you see, I mean, maybe that's a dumb question. I was going to say, like, mo would you say most of the people you work with, they're artists, obviously, right? Because mm -hmm. you're doing videos for them mm -hmm. or whatever. Do you do you ever work with people? Like, do you have an example of work you've done for people who aren't artists? You know what I mean? Like, like maybe they want corporate headshots, or maybe they want like a commercial for their right. uh, dildo uh, dildo <laughs> office. Is dildo office a thing? Yes. Dildo store. All right. Warehouse. Warehouse. Ooh, yeah. lots of dildo office. <laughs> uh what then they want like um like okay they want to throw in their two cents more so like i guess the question is what's the ratio of as far as your clientele what's the right. ratio of artists to non-artists you know what i'm saying like, it, like i think it's like 10 like probably like once every 10 artists I guess. okay i so got you usually like the same people yeah. They usually have like a like a um, recurring artist, I guess. They like usually just come back, yeah. and that usually fills my plate like enough. Right. So I don't really don't. I really, yeah. It's really it's very once in a while that yeah. I work with people that I don't. I'm not really that used to working with every yeah. other month or every month. Do you, Do you prefer it that way? Do you prefer to kind of like work with recurring clients? Kind of because. Let's uh, like like if I want to if if I'm doing the video mm -hmm. or photo or anything, there's not really a back and forth because mm -hmm. I already know you and I know what you like. Right, right. With a new artist, it's like oh shit, he might not like. Yeah, <laughs> like, no, that makes perfect sense. He might he might want to go back and forth, and it might like a two day thing might turn into a week thing, mm -hmm. or it might be he's like like I've had it to I have I've had it to like where I dropped it, like send him the video and I sent him the rough draft in my eyes it's a rough draft yeah and he's like it's perfect and I'm like what what like no it's yeah right. <laughs> like no it's not like, it's yeah. like so that's why it's like ah oh, fuck so that's why with new people it's like you kind of get the people that really are grateful for anything I guess yeah because I guess they're so used to like lower level things mm -hmm. or like not as professional or whatever mm -hmm. Or you get the people that you don't like. They want a bunch of things. Yeah, what you're so saying is they're really... used to working with people who are nowhere near as dope as you are. That's what you're saying. I'll go yeah. ahead and fill in all those blanks for you. Yeah, it's just it's one of those things. It's yeah. either one of those things. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's how I became aware of you. First of all, when's, when did we do your when did podcast? We meet? Okay, um, <laughs> I don't know. Like twenty. It was a minute ago, 2015 maybe? I want to say 16, but 16? yeah, probably 15. Yeah, 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 it's one of those. I remember, yeah. That's the last time we've done this. That was the first time we actually spoke for like three hours. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> staring at each other. That's true, in, your, in your living room with your yeah, wife yeah. chilling too. Yeah. Um, uh, that's how, and I bring that up because obviously. Do you remember anything from that thing? Um, I feel like I do not. Like I don't at all. From our conversation? It yeah. was long as fuck too. Yeah. It was a two-parter. Yeah. Um, I remember you were so giddy. Like you were so excited. Was I? Yeah. I felt like you were so like you didn't want it to stop type of feeling. Yeah, I, was I was like, oh, it's cool. I like that. It was, that was cool. That it was good. cool environment. And like yeah. we, we've always like vibed. You know what right. I mean? We could just talk for fucking ever. Um, 
Plus, we were drinking and just hanging. Right. That's you know? true, too. Yeah, so yeah. it was cool. Um, I remember it being a lot of fun. Plus, I wanted to get into podcasting. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, So yeah, it was yeah, like yeah. kind of like, oh, this is yeah. cool. You know what I mean? Um, but no, I don't. I don't remember a lot. I, I remember, obviously, we focused on me a lot because you were essentially you, interviewing yeah. me. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? But other than that, like, I don't really remember specifics. Uh, I'd love to hear it again. I think yeah. you sent Did you send it to me? Yeah, I did. You did? I okay. think I did. I think I downloaded it, actually. Um, yeah, it was anyway. an, it was an under another channel, so I, I didn't. I thought it. I thought oh. it was under my my channel, and then okay. when I looked for it, I was like, "Yeah, I don't have it." And then I was like, "Oh, fuck, well, no way! It's yeah it's under another channel." Okay. And it was right there. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I I, I remember the um, conversation of uh, of you kind of growing up, which was kind of uh, kind of yeah. really cool, like yeah, the way you yeah. were moves from here to there, and then um, the whole meeting um, everybody around you. It was yeah, cool. it was really yeah. it's cool. cool. Yeah, podcasts I mean, are fun, man. T- they are, bro. Are fun. They are for sure. Um, to kind of recap what we talked about back then, I, I, the first time I heard of you was like, I think you did a video for, um, uh, John May and KP, Kid Presentable. Okay. Uh, Beast of Tree and Kid Presentable. I can't remember. Uh, the Haze? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. think uh, they were like lighting fire, like yep. a trash can was on fire yep. or some yep. shit. Okay. That's when I first heard of you. I was at uh I was at Beast of Tree's house and he was kind of showing me and he said that you were doing the video. Right. So that's the first time I heard your name. And then it was one of those things that happened that comes up a lot on the show where it's like you hear something for the first time and then like you hear about it every single day. So what, it's like seeing a new car and it, you see exactly. the car everywhere. Yeah. Exactly. So then I think, oh, to bring it full circle, then Exer dropped a video, uh, revival. And right. you shot it, which Boom. you just hit Fuck a meal. <laughs> yeah. So, Boom. so congrats on on thank that you, shit. Thank you, thank yeah, you. I know everyone was stoked about that. Thank you, thank you. Um, how many of your videos hit have hit a mil? Like two, two three, of them. Two or th- I feel like it's three, but I think it's two for sure. Which ones are they? So revival. Uh, uh, revival is the, the the second one. Uh, the first one was nothing to say with uh, Reverie. Okay. And okay. then the third one that's kind of close closing in is um, it's either. It's either two uh, that are closing in pretty pretty soon. It's um, it's uh, mind in another world. With, oh yeah, uh, thesis, thesis and self. Earth and self. Yeah, yeah. and the other one is uh, Exer and self. The um, yeah. Uh, fucking couch South is garage. Chilling. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, one, that one. Yeah, that yeah, one. yeah, yeah. I forgot the I forgot the name, but yeah, that, <laughs> those are the two that are kind of nearing in. Yeah. How many videos have you done? You've told me, but yep. I, I just remember it's a fuckload. Yeah. It's, How many? Um, fuck, I feel like it's two over 240. 240 videos. Yeah. <laughs> fuck, dude. That's two crazy. Over, two over 240, yeah. And is that just music videos? Yeah. I, categor- <laughs> I had to categorize yeah. it like under there, under music videos, because then if not, then I'll just fucking, it was the number probably is double. It, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, music videos, I think it's over two 240. God damn. I know for sure it's over 220, but like I know 20 of them, like over 20 of them I couldn't find. I don't mm-hmm. know if they deleted it or whatever, but. Yeah. And then one of my drives like fucking died or two of my drives died from like 2016 to 2017 and then another one from 2018 to 2019. But like month wise. Yeah. Okay. I got you. Not like the whole year lost. It's like uh, September to like fucking December, and then another one from like January to uh, October. Can you recover that, or do you have any desire no. to recover it? <laughs> I'm trying. I tried one, but uh, the guy's like, um, he's uh, he did it for like 120, and that's okay. just like a thousand, like two thousand or fifteen hundred to recover everything fuck. and i just don't want to do that yeah fuck all that <laughs> uh like yeah i i'm i think all of it's lost unless i want to drop like 1500 just yeah. to recover it but i don't even know what i'm gonna need right if anything and just take the l yeah i feel it are you how do you go about or do you go about backing shit up because i'm real bad at that as far i just as have like, one backup that's it okay like it's just that drive that drive dies that's it yeah. <laughs> like all right fuck it like yeah I can't can't Yo, recover that, <clears throat> which is basically what happened with the two drives. Like, can't. yeah, that's something like it always comes up in our right. our field. But I'm just like, eh, I'll, eventually, eventually. Because most I mean? of the times it's like video. It's you know, I don't I don't think they want the raw clips of it. Right. As long as, as, as I long just as keep you have it, just, the, yeah. the final product. I just yeah. keep it just to keep it. As long as the, it's the final product, then it's fine. But um, I keep it to just have it. I guess. Sure. And I'm pretty bad at like um, um, saving my stuff. Like in, in the proper folders, so oh, okay. Xers, um, 
top sh- top ch- ch- chilling top villains or top some villains, shit like that that's what it is yeah i was yeah, like yeah. top chilling right now yeah. <laughs> so actually like top chilling might yeah. have like some random photos of fucking where we were oh so okay. that's you. why i keep that's why i keep everything because i don't because i don't have time to go back and fucking look through everything every folder yeah yeah but, yeah and then like uh, like two years ago i started um <laughs> i was doing so much work that i was um categorizing it as like um new shit new shit two, new Yo, shit three 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 i've so, literally <laughs> that's what i always do yeah, yeah. come back to this new new shit yeah new Brand new, new, new shit yeah new but, shit in 2019 yeah. I put, sometimes i put and you like new new like yeah the, uh, as if years from now you're gonna be like oh shit. that's the yeah, nu folder yep. yeah i know exactly what that is so you that folder know? has multiple fucking things yeah and it's like fuck i have to like but then i started getting to the hang of, of uh, may 2020 yeah uh, march 2020 february 2020 yeah man it it goes back to like you're saying like your closet organizing your closet it's just like you avoid for me like i avoid Uh doing it because i know it's going to take so much time Uh but then the longer you avoid it the more time it's going to take when you finally stop avoiding Mm -hmm. it and then you finally like for me i stopped avoiding it and Mm -hmm. then i was like oh that's not that bad like it takes a Mm -hmm. day but Mm -hmm. i mean how many years you've been doing it you know what i mean so once you get it done, it, it's plus when you start doing it because I did it like two weeks ago, but yeah. I didn't do it to that extent. I did yeah, it yeah. to like um, this guy wanted uh, clips, and I've like followed him for like three years. Okay. So I was looking through every folder because I had to because yeah. I didn't categorize it right. And for some reason, my Mac's like doing this weird thing where like I t- type in the search bar and I type in the name, but it's not fucking coming up. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, so I can't. I have to like literally go through every folder just oh, to try to Jesus. look for it. And you have yeah. the patience to do that. <laughs> with, so yeah. I, I've, I think the looking for that dude's um, work took yeah. me like three or four days because I constantly kept like looking shit, and I'm like, oh fuck, I have that. What the fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Put it on the top. Main that's thing. kind of fun when you. It's do nice that, though. You that's, know what I mean? That's cool as fuck to, to to be like, oh shit, I do have like I forgot that I did. I was there. Yeah. Type of thing. Yeah, for so sure. Good. Yeah, yeah. What um. And we've talked about this before, but what is this thing that some of us have that is just this? I don't know if in my in my sense, I'll, I'll, in, in my in my case, I'll say it's a need. Like I have this fucking constant need, this burning urge to do a bunch of things. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, would, you, would you describe yourself that way? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Very, very much so. OK. Is it a need or more like a desire? Like, I, I feel like there's a difference there because I, I go about it like in an anxious way. Like, yeah, I, I got to get my hands on a bunch of yeah. things. And you seem to be more zen about it. We're just like, well, that looks cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'll <laughs> fucking try that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think so, too. Um, I don't know. It's probably a desire to do it because. Um, I mean, you're already, you know, if you're good at a one thing, you kind of you could just keep doing it be the best you could be or you mm-hmm. can just fucking try out different little things and yeah. see if you like that or not so who yeah. knows you might like fucking doing podcasts more than you like taking photos or sure something. yeah it's uh you never know have you always been that way even like in like are there any other aspects of your life that you're kind of uh you 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 approach it that way i don't um i don't think so i th- um Cause it's all creative stuff that yeah. usually goes with that type mm-hmm. of thing. I think with like not creative stuff, which yeah. is still kind of, I think it would still be creative stuff, right? Like if it was, even if it wasn't like photo video of any visual stuff or whatever that we do. Yeah. I think it's still kind of like, um, like, um, I don't know. Like I've always wanted to cut hair. Mm. I've always wanted to, um, cook, to cook, to learn how to cook, yes, to same. learn how to bake. Like, I see what you're saying. Wanna, so it's not so it's technically creative stuff. art, but it's yeah, creative. There you go. It's yeah, not, yeah. I, I get it. But some people say, oh, yeah. cooking's an art. Like, but you know what the fuck I mean. Like, not to downplay yeah. cooking, but I, so, I do know what you mean. So I think once the photography stuff kind of came into play, I think, yeah, I, I guess I kind of started doing a little bit more of like, oh, I kind of want to skate. I kind of want to fucking mm. do this or do that. Yeah. Because I do want to, you know, I want to skate. I want to cut hair. I want to uh, bake. I want to cook. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I guess. I do in that regard I do but it's kind of creative so I guess I do everything I do I kind of want to do everything sure yeah dude I that you and I definitely have talked many times about that (laughs) and we relate in that sense and I've come to to kind of think of it differently I used to think that there are there's this pool of people who want to do a bunch of things and then there's the rest of them who just like don't want to do anything you know what I mean they're perfectly fine not doing anything Mm -hmm. now 
I, I've That's come to crazy. think of it. It's, yo, <laughs> it baffles me, dude. Like, what the, what? Sometimes I fucking, <laughs> we've talked about this, sometimes I envy them. <laughs> like, you're perfectly fine going to work, coming home, watching TV, going oh, to sleep, it. and doing it all yeah. over again. Dude, I would fucking go crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I've come to think of, instead of, like, people who want to do a bunch of things and then people who don't want to do anything, I think there's, it's more people, I think everyone kind of wants to, like, they have their list of things that they want to do. Mm. If you're gonna if you're going to categorize people, put put it more like the people who actually execute those things and the people who don't. Do you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. So some of us, and I'm not I'm not at all implying like it's a noble thing. I'm not really like gassing people like us up. I'm just but I think the fact of the matter is you and I and a lot of people that we hang out with, we just for whatever reason have this thing in us that like will actually take will go one step further and actually try these things you know what i'm saying Mm -hmm. and that's why we look we either look super ambitious or fucking crazy and reckless and selfish depending on who's receiving it you know what i'm saying what do you are you the only one like you like in your family um doing the most yeah but like, what about brothers. just like generally, like creatively? No, they all. My, I think everybody in my family, besides my mom, like they always do something, other, something else. What a uh, what something specific? Um, like so my mom's my mom, so she doesn't really do much. Yeah. She's always wanted to, you know, family. Big, yeah, sure, big, sure. So that that's that was her thing. That was yeah. her goal. So she did it. Yeah. Um, for my oldest brother, um, he's into cars so he builds cars like okay he's building his car i think he's almost done it took him like three four no, i think like four or five years is that his career it's kind of like a side no, thing it's like a side thing cool so um he did like uh you know the old camaros type of sure. chargers shit that, yeah you know, classic big, cars and mm-hmm. shit yeah. so she, he has that one um before that he was doing like all these web designs so he already knew how to i think like coding and all this shit that mm-hmm. the people did i don't know a dream weaver or whatever yeah, the fuck yeah. that is all that yeah. stuff so he, he already knew all that stuff before like fucking Wix and <laughs> all this other shit that right, just right. ruined everything <laughs> or like made it easier <laughs> yeah, for everybody. Yeah, I feel um, you. So he did that. Uh, my second oldest, uh, uh, he graffiti writer, graffiti okay. artist. So he knows all his color blending and all this stuff. He's yeah. a graphic designer. So he knows all the ins and outs of Photoshop, Illustrator, all that stuff. So he does that. A little bit of mm. photography too, which is okay. kind of cool. Is that the one that went out with you on when you did the vlog? You were shooting liquor stores? No, no that's, oh. uh, that's, uh, that's the youngest. Okay, youngest okay. Uh, so yeah, that's what my brother does. Um, okay. Youngest, which is that one, the one that was on the first episode. Yeah. Uh, he's, I guess he got into photography too. So he went there and then um, he went that route. But he's more into like um, photojournalism type mm, of thing so yeah. he knows how to write stuff and like sure uh, so i think like a more sporting or like um anything you see um newspaper shit like mm. newspaper articles and stuff like that he'll, yeah so he'll take the dope ass photo and then he'll write about it <laughs> like dope. or what the fuck's happening yeah that's really cool i fuck with that so yeah. everybody's kind of into their own things yeah. yeah and what about pops uh, i asked that yeah, because dad, like where uh, did this come from yeah my dad uh um <clears throat> uh, it was a crazy story um if it was, I think he left with his house when he was 12, hmm. came back when he was 16. He's um, from here? Or no, he's from Mexico. From Mexico, uh, okay. Michoacan. Okay. And then um, I think he was working a bunch. And then after that, he went to America, came here to, hmm. uh, to L.A. Um, uh, he was a musician, so he was traveling around L.A. area or I think everywhere around here. What kind of musician? Uh, guitarist. Oh, cool. Guitarist and uh, singer. Like in so, a band or? Yep, so, yep. Oh, sick. So okay. guitarist and singer. Uh, I think the banda uh fuck, i forget it's like caracol was one i think okay. it was another one um i forget i have a picture of him yeah um but he did that and then um after that he was he went to he stopped and then he wanted he became like an agent i think i really don't know because it was small it yeah. was like you know like 10 10 to 12 area or 8 to 12 area okay was it no like five to twelve area mm. I think um he he became like an agent or like someone on the road a lot with the musician, which yeah. was um all those uh, riveras I don't know if you're familiar with like the Spanish music no not not so like the riveras are like this <laughs> big family that have like um there's Jenny uh Lupio Juan the dad and okay. like another brother or something like that so okay. all of them like sing and all them you know have that type of music style. Yeah. And my dad was going out uh, with this guy, and then from there he went with the daughter. The, 
the son, the other son. Okay. So he was going out with all of them. So I, I know for one of them, he was like, he started from nothing and he became who the fuck he was. Yeah. Right? So that's kind of cool. My dad being around that. Yeah. Hell know, yeah. I'd go into his office in the garage and seeing all these fucking photos and shit. I'm like, oh yeah. shit, it's crazy. Yeah. Uh, but then that was, that was him. So, okay. and then after that, he, um, he started his own uh, company, his own record label, uh, Perico Records, and he did that, it's still running. And um, yeah, he started that in 2000. So Your, your dad started yeah, a record label. Yeah. Okay. In 2000, wow. he started Sick. a record label, then he got all these fucking artists. I think right now it's like over 300 uh, CDs that he's oh, shit. posted or something okay. or whatever, released. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and then, <laughs> posted yeah yeah that's like yeah, so he's, modern, he modern released, language. He released yeah, yeah. over 300 or something and yeah. under his under the label under the thing he released over 300 yeah damn okay yeah that's great and he that's what he still does or, or? uh he's a little bit a little bit because the whole um um he was in, you know uh when you're doing that type of music it's really um old school type so okay you kind of uh invest in a certain thing and i, I don't think he caught on the train of uh, the internet as, yeah, as fast as uh, others so yeah. it's kind of growing a little bit but sure yeah it's good so <laughs> you can cool. more or less attribute all the creativity yeah. or whatever to, to pops yeah i guess that I, i've talked to uh, to ashley about it my wife actually yeah um recently it was more of uh he was because we were like how what do i what who am i more of like mm -hmm. my mom or my dad yeah and i always think my dad because he like he does like a shit ton of things yeah and like yeah. i do a shit ton of things yeah and like i he works a lot and i work a lot so it's like you know and he like didn't do the normal like get a job do this and this and this and that. yeah I like i didn't i did but like i did a bunch of things leading up to where i am now sure so that's why it's like i'm more of i know more of my dad in that in that way yeah and it sounds like like him when you do something you do it to death like yeah. fucking 200 yeah. and whatever videos yeah. later uh, yeah. and then he has like 300 yeah. artists signed you know what i mean he was the that's, that's crazy. how i that's how i did the that's how i got into the whole thing yeah he was um he was i think it was like under under the hundreds um i was like 14 i think um he needed someone to take the cover art for the bands so he gave me like this little camera, this little point, oh, point and shoot fucking little Canon digital camera. Yeah. It was like 14, 12 megapixels or some oh, shit. Oh, okay. So I got it and then I was like, sweet. Yeah. And then I took the pictures of the fucking, I took the portraits of the people, the bands. Yeah. And then I would go to their live shows with my dad, yeah. um, capture like the video footage of them playing. And then mm -hmm. like, that, that was my first. Oh, shit. Instance. How old are you at this point? 14, 14, 15. Okay. Wow. Yeah. That was my first like, the, you know thing introduction approach. yeah uh, i got you i got when, you when i saw my name on the um the little booklet i was like fuck yeah that, that, was, cool that was it dude that was the seed yeah. <laughs> it fucking grew a monster yeah that's that's crazy it's cool as fuck yeah man so is he how does he feel about your life is he like supportive or i mean is he yeah. very aware <laughs> of it i don't think he's that aware of it but yeah i, I think he knows like i do a lot yeah so yeah it's yeah kinda, it's kind of cool um yeah but i think he know he knows that i do a lot of stuff yeah so it's like um yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> so i got he, you has he, he ever been to a show because no. i, I, I want to talk about i mean it's too. so easy for him to like for my for my mom and dad to go to the show because yeah. i literally because we live on like two blocks away from the main street mm -hmm. and just so happens there's like a, a record uh store and yeah. we had an in-store record store show yeah. in that, that store. And I was like, come down, like, two blocks away. And they still fucking did a cuff. Wow. <laughs> I was like, fuck. Why is that, do you think? I, I don't know. They don't like going out. Like yeah, that, so. okay. So okay. I was like, fuck, let's go. That was, like, the easiest time for them to come. Like, yeah. can't wait for, like, the little snippets. And I'm just like, I was like, how the fuck you be, B? And then they <laughs> fucking tune in to the whole podcast. And they have, like, no idea because I didn't say that shit throughout the whole fucking thing. <laughs> See, that's the thing, bro. Like, you and I, we think about shit like that. I'm, I'm yeah. constantly thinking of like, oh, that's a clip. Oh, that's yeah. a clip. You know what I mean? I, I wanted to do this one. Hi, me. Because <laughs> I'm going to watch this shit later. I'll be yeah. like, hey. I'll fucking post that video of me on Instagram. Like, oh, shit, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> fucking rip in this FaceTime continuum. That's crazy. I just uh, use big words. I don't even know what the fuck that really means. I just heard it on Rogan or some shit. Space time continuum. What does that even mean? There's a lot of people who knew exactly what that means. Rip it. Um, What's up? Talk about your, um, before we get into music, uh, 
you recently oh okay we'll start there recently you started a vlog and you've always wanted a vlog yep we've talked about this sure did and you finally just fucking went for it yeah huh uh-huh. how um how is that going so far it's felt um great in a sense <laughs> but like it's been inside the fucking house sometimes right it's as far as uh recording like, yeah, like um, the first episode is the one where we go, go to the liquor stores and I, I take the pictures of the liquor stores because yeah. I thought it was um, I thought liquor stores raise you kind of in a sense. Yeah, at least for me because like I thought that was interesting. Yeah, because I remember the liquor store that I was in, and in in the later episode I talk about the um, the house, the, my house, my old house that yeah. we were in. So my old house, we had um, we had owned the the house next door, so we always walked through their their driveway. Okay, walked through the alley. And then went through the back of the liquor store, and then we went to the liquor store, bought our shit, and came back out that way. Yeah. So it was always like that. Who knew us? We always knew the spot, and I remember everything, every fucking little detail. The mm. paint chips, the fucking chips were here. The this was here. And yeah. I never would buy this, and you know the sure. little juicies, the big juicies. I remembered everything, so um, it raised me in a sense, mm-hmm. and I would love to go back to that spot, right? So. The funny thing is, is when we all moved, because that block, like all everything moved, that store um, went to another side of town. Mm-hmm. And I had no idea. And my dad told me like later on, he's like, oh, it's fucking, the, you know, Don, Don uh, Juan or whatever. I forget his name. Okay. Yeah. Same. Owners I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. And then yeah. I went in going, dude, fucking going into that spot. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> like, yeah. what the fuck? How did he do that? Like. This is the paint chips. This is the fucking chips rack. Oh, shit. Like, how the fuck did he do that? And then I was going through it. I'm like, no fucking way. And then that's why I did that specifically for that video. Interesting. Because um, I did a video specifically for that store because um, because of that. But yeah. the thing is, we, when we went, um, the guy was super sketched out. And like it wasn't the guy that I knew. And the guy oh, was okay. like, yeah, I bought the store like a year ago. And I was yeah. like, oh, man, that He sucks. was sketched out because you had cameras yeah. and like the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, I was like, oh, that sucks. So it kind of like tainted. Because the way he like br- approached us all mm. aggressive, I was like, oh, it kind of tainted that feeling. Yeah. That fucking thing. That's in the video, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah. So, but yeah, a little bit. They're all a little sketched out uh, when we'd show up and take yeah. pictures of the buildings. They're like, what the fuck? Like, Pe- people don't like fucking yeah, cameras. People don't. either love cameras or, they, or they're yeah. scared of cameras. Yeah, so most of the time they were um, the people, the owners were like like that. But I, there was a few that were like pretty nice about it, or they didn't really say much about yeah. it. Yeah, but uh, yeah, the whole vlog series it's awesome because um, I really don't know where I'm gonna go with it. Mm-hmm. Uh, in a sense that you know every YouTube um, account has like just um, editing tutorials or fucking photo tutorials or how to shoot this like or, niche fucking, or whatever yeah, I this got is you. just vlogs this is cooking this is gaming this is whatever yeah and i fucking i'm you know i do everything yes <laughs> i want to do everything yes so it's like so i just decided to do the vlog series of just this is what i'm doing mm-hmm. this episode and i do a lot of shit so yeah we, you know tune in because yeah, yeah. you never know where the fuck i'm gonna be sure yeah so yeah that's why in but it's but yeah but it's the recent ones are all the ones uh, i've all been inside so i kind of had to get creative on it and then um yeah i started doing the um the the flashbacks in a sense yeah so i would the house one was one where i filmed when we moved out because we had to move out because there was a um they wanted to build a school where we uh where we lived so they kicked out like a bunch of people in Mm -hmm. that block and they kicked they kicked out all the people that um, the the hotel that was there, the liquor stores that were there, the shoe place I think, this hair salon. They kicked everything out. Yeah. And then they all moved. And then it's pretty much that whole block is still there, but like there's like a divider. There's like a little block. There's mm-hmm. a there's a house, house 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 boom, mm-hmm. wall school. Yeah. Oh, so like three blo- three houses from that like three houses. No, it was like I was the. It was like they did once, like they, they did five houses. They took down five houses, mm. and I was the first two of that block. Oh right. So it's like my memory, poof, just erased. Gone. Yeah. Yeah. Like everything in That's my head. I was. Like, this is where I used to walk. Boom. Nothing. Yeah. Like, so yeah. I can't revisit that. So what I did um, before we moved, I had my dad's camera that he gave me. Um, I was shooting everything, video, photo, everything. Yeah. So um, I captured everything, and then. Um, in 
So I'm talking, I'm narrating the whole thing. I'm talking to the, the camera. Yeah. And I'm using the audio as the narration. And <clears throat> I'm using all the photos, all the videos that I shot. It's fucking crazy. Because, <laughs> you know, obviously, you know, I don't know who the fuck I'm going to be in like t- t- in then or sure. now, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in 2006 or seven, like, it was a fucking trip, like, capturing all these moments. Like, right. So then, um, yeah, photo, video. You see my old dog there. You see the, the entrance where I used to walk. And it's so trippy. Like, mm-hmm. just walking through in my you know my little kid fucking thing sure walking through the my old fucking um trees walking yeah. through the little lead up to my house yeah going to the garage going to the in through the house mm-hmm. seeing the walls that i grew up in and just like it's not there like you can't revisit it it's so fucking trippy i'm gonna ask because i actually talked about that specifically with greaseball you like meaning you uh uh-huh. because i'm overly nostalgic like i'll get Mm -hmm. sad real fast do you consider yourself a nostalgic person like that or like when you i know you're saying like oh it's a trip and yes it's a trip Mm -hmm. but is it like is it a positive thing is it a negative thing is it just kind of a a, a heavy thing how 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 do you feel i don't know it's kind of i think it was kind of heavy it's like a heavy thing right i mean obviously we moved into a better a better house sure uh we have we're still there now um everybody's there everybody's together um, but that was, you know, that was our first house mm-hmm. and just having that feeling of like, you could probably, well, who knows, you maybe you could go to your old house where yeah. you grew up. I can't, that sucks. Right. Like, I just get, and the whole, the fact is that like, not even that block is there. Like yeah. fucking half the block is missing. Right. Like, it's right. Just, like, you can't, it's like, like no remnants so it's of like it a, at all. It's like yeah. a, he- it's a heavy thing. It's not a positive thing. I had to move out positive only being that we're now in the old, the, the new house, the, sure. the good house, the better yeah. house or whatever, bigger house. Because the old house had like two rooms in it. Mm-hmm. I slept in, I slept on the other, I slept on my own bed. Uh, my mom and dad on the other side. My yeah. little brother right there below me. My other two brothers in the other room. Mm-hmm. It's like the small house. Yeah. Because it was just a room, room, little hallway, restroom, kitchen, living room. That's it. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah we went to better things, but just, we can't go back. That's what sucks. Yeah. And for, you know, for me, it was like, that sucks. That's my house that we grew up in. For my mom and dad, it's like, that was their home. That was, they Where went they, from Mexico to here. And they to, raised their babies they there. They raised their all, kids. Yeah, like, that's dude. why it's like, that's why it's heavy. Mm-hmm. Like, that's why it's heavy. Like, it yeah. sucks that, 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 that you can't do that. Yeah. So I did the video. I posted the video. Didn't tell anybody. But, you know, when you do things like this, for the vlog series, especially for me, um, like, every episode i really like like i really like Mm because there's and like i take my time with them and it's just so funny to it's it's so it's it's i don't know it's like it's just so funny that i've always wanted to do this and Mm -hmm. then i started doing it and i'm dropping every episode every episode is like cool as fuck to me Mm -hmm. because it's it's what i want to do yeah and then the house one which is cool as shit to me because i always wanted i always wanted to do that obviously because i took the video clips since in 2007 Going to now, 2020, yeah, editing everything, narrating everything, and then made my mom cry, my dad cry, my brother cry. Like, yeah, everyone is like, just like that sucks. That's like, it. So it's like, ah, oh, yes. Like, <laughs> in a sense, I'm like, fuck yeah. Like, yeah. That's, that's a good yeah. thing, though. Yes. No, I, I completely that means get that, it. That means it worked. That, that means had an impact. I, yeah, that, I, yes. That exactly. So that exactly. means it worked. That video Dude, whole thing worked. I don't me, think I a lot of people understand that, and that you. I, even creatives, I'll say, like, there's uh, something to that. Like, obviously, you don't want to make the people you care about cry, but it's just something, there's something, you're tapping into something that they weren't even prepared. Maybe you reached into them in a sense that they didn't even know that they felt a certain way. Uh-huh. They, you know what I mean? And, like, uh-huh. had you not, had you not have basically f- essentially force them to to look at that to feel those feelings like they mm-hmm. might not have even realized that they were ca- like there was something there to feel in the mm-hmm. first place that's what's so cool about that shit that's tight mm-hmm. you know if i could make if i especially people i like and love or whatever if i can make mm-hmm. you laugh or cry mm-hmm. i'm fucking stoked mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying that's tight yeah i really uh yeah the whole episode's cool as fuck yeah. uh, i haven't watched it since because you know it might might get me sad but sure like, sure like, it, yeah it's a it's a it's a hitter 
Yeah. Later. But I always like when people um, message me about it because mm-hmm. they some I did get messages like that too. Like, dude, I fucking I can't lose in my home too. I'm like, oh, it's tight. Like, yeah. not tight, but like, oh shit, it's yeah. cool. That's yeah, other people yeah. like that feeling the, the same idea way. of being able to relate. That's what's yeah. tight. Yeah. The, the liquor store one got the same uh, reaction. Like, mm-hmm. shit, dude, I fucking this is my liquor store. Like, yeah. I'm like, oh, it's cool. Like, See, and it, yo, like until you did that, like a lot of people might not have realized, like, oh, I do have a liquor store. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Like uh-huh. that is my liquor store yeah. that I grew up with. I don't you know what I'm now. saying? No, <laughs> I yeah, I, 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 I do now, but I grew no, up. I same. Cool. I grew up with the liquor like, store. In a sense, to like where you know the person. You yeah, know, what's fuck up? Yeah, what's up, bro? He knows gonna, what hey, you're gonna up? buy and yeah. shit. Yeah, that's exactly. It's that's tight, where dude. it's like cool as fuck. Yeah, right? man. Yeah, that's the that's that one. I, I really liken like that, that to like like the old school dude who like goes to the bar and shit, uh-huh. and it's like they know exactly. Yeah. Hey, there's Mike. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like Mike always gets a whiskey sour or whatever the fuck. You know what I mean? That's I've always liked that. Yeah, that's always cool as fuck. Hell yeah. It's a it's a sense of belonging. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's cool, mm-hmm. man. That that's super cool, especially organically like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Have um how many vlogs do you have out? You fucking 13. <laughs> See, that's how you are, yo. You like <laughs> you'll like you'll talk about something the, right. for a long time and uh-huh. then when you finally do it, it's just like I'm going to do it to death. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And that's tight. Like I've literally watched you do that since I've known you. Right. And like no bullshit, you are a big reason I've done as many of these. Cause like, yeah, there's yeah. there's this weird thing. You're I'm welcome, like, fuck, bitches. M- M- Muds would have been on fucking episode one hundred and fifty by right. now. You know what I mean? I'm on like twenty five. Yeah. You know what I mean? But like, I, I generally obsess about something right for a that's couple a, months. That's how you are, out. though. Yeah, yeah. You I'm, have to like make it perfect, and even then, when it's launched, it's still not perfect. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's how you are. And we, yo. Something how I've always a way I've always described you mm-hmm. is handsome. you oh handsome certainly <laughs> handsome. the first one has yeah to be, that's right. oh, yeah of course. Of, course. of course but beyond handsome you you always like like if we're shooting together I'm shooting you or whatever I'll show you the photo uh-huh. oh, and okay. you have a very monotone like yeah. neutral way of reacting everybody says that. or I can't tell like yeah. if you fuck with it or if you love it <laughs> or if you don't like it because it's just like if it's shit you'd be like mm, yeah. and then if it's great you'd be like mm, yeah. I'm like so there's just a tiny little change of pitch if it's like mm, yeah, that's bad if it's, mm, yeah. it's oh okay that's good he loves it yeah, you know dude. what I'm saying I, I I have no I have no follow yeah. up to that, but that's just how you've always been. Uh-huh. Yeah, um, it's but uh, it's not like you're emotionless. Uh-huh. That's not at all <laughs> what it is. It's just uh, I think you're very. I envy it in a sense. You're very you're a right. zen ass dude. You right. know what I mean? Um, Thank you. I'll never forget. Oh yes. You asked me like I was gonna. Sh- it was the first time I was shooting East of the River, right? Okay, yeah. And for people who don't know, like East of the River is a, a rap collective. With how many fucking people? It's like eight. Eight. eight yeah, I remember it being a a, a ton a good at amount, the time. Yeah, yeah. It's like eight now. And I, I we're gonna take group photos and then individual portraits or whatever. Right. right. Excuse me. Uh, my wife came with me, and we all met at the party. Like, dude, just getting one person. Or obviously, including me, two people to uh-huh. to meet up for a podcast like this, like it's complicated. You know, right. motherfuckers got lives and shit. Yeah. So then you coordinate it with. We did you know, it twice. Uh, uh, we shot twice. Foot. Yeah, exactly. But like the first time, I'm I'm just saying like it's not lost on me the idea that all these fucking people have their individual lives, their jobs, their kids, their whatever. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Flat tires, all mm-hmm. the fucking things that could happen. Either way, like all these people managed to get in one place at one time and I'm there to shoot them. And I open, <laughs> I look at my camera and I'll have a fucking oh, SD yeah, card. That's right. Yeah. I and I'm the photographer. That. Right. And oh, I'm that's like, right. Oh, fuck. That's oh, right, dude. I fuck. forgot about that. I drove all the way from Anaheim or wherever, oh, the orange, wherever the fuck I was living at the time. Right. And I remember like my heart just <laughs> sunk. Dude, I forgot about that. Oh, I'm a goddamn, shit. um, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, everything's a goddamn catastrophe i'm like right. oh fuck oh, that's it about it's that. over i'm never fucking shooting yeah. photos again and then i remember oh well muds is here right he's obviously he probably has his shit in the car i could just ask him but i was like embarrassed as fuck <laughs> i didn't want no one to know and i'm like freaking the fuck out to my wife i'm like babe i don't have a fucking sd card she's like her she's practiced like do you want me to drive home and get it i'm like oh it's so very sweet. sweet but i'm like right. no because that's gonna take like two hours you know what i mean yeah and 
I'm, I'm, I'm like on my phone looking best like buy. is Best Buy exactly. Yeah. I'm like, is there a Best Buy around here? Right. There's not. P.S. Everyone's at the park. Motherfuckers got plans after. Right. I'm like, either way, it wasn't. It was far from ideal. Yeah. And I remember telling you, I'm like, all right, all right, come come here real quick. And we walked around oh, the car, right. and I was like, all right, uh, so I don't have an SD card. And you're like, oh, oh okay, oh, okay. I'm like. I'm hope does that mean you have an SD card? And you're like, oh, I don't know. Like, yeah. <laughs> so, w- at what point is does I can't, this become you, a bad thing in your head? Because you, you seem real you, unaffected you by can't, this. You know, you can't. Um, I can't. I can't tell you. Yes, I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I guess, like, I don't, I'm like, I don't know. I was at least expecting. I was hoping I did. It I don't remember where I came feel from. Better. Uh huh. In a sense, in the moment, I made you super uh, calm. You're like, okay, he's not tripping. Yeah, but that didn't really help anything. Right. But I was like, That's okay. <laughs> um, and then I'm like, well, because he doesn't look stupid. I yeah. look fucking stupid. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I think we That's funny. <laughs> we went and dug around in your trunk and you managed to find an SD so. card or whatever. Yeah, mm-hmm. so you fucking bailed me out. Mm-hmm. Um, but I'll never... I, I, I legit apply that to a lot of things in my life. Like when... I mean, in that moment is huge, right? But like relative to everything else that could go wrong like it's not a huge deal right. i mean worst case scenario worst case scenario we got to do the shoot again so i'm right. sorry guys i apologize i'm an fuck asshole the, you know what i mean yeah. i I'm, yeah that is a fucking we would have just made the most but we just no one had a meeting about it or some shit yeah we exactly just done something yeah uh-huh. so i just try to apply that's funny like your reaction to that, that. you're yeah. just like huh, well and and then I just took that as like, oh well, I have a bunch of SD cards. I'm like, okay, so you have some? You're like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> well, what the fuck? Who reacts to who fucking navigates life like that? Fucking zen ass people. I love That's it, funny. dude. I love it. That's fucking funny. I we're, forgot. Yeah, that did happen. We're like yin and yang, you and I. I feel like because you're like super like chill, yeah. but not that. You're but not at not all. Chill. Like yes, exactly. <laughs> you're overly. Not I'm chill. anxious, and you're like just okay. calm, but right. not like. Not I in feel a like that comes off, way. I feel like that comes <laughs> off as a um as a, a fucking pre- not pretentious but like kind of like a, the way you are. Yeah, I feel like it comes off uh, like um I don't know. <laughs> I don't explain it. Like it's you're like not a, too worried about it. Like yeah, um, I feel like it's that's it's fucked up that I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. There's definitely a word for it. Um, it you come off as um. Um, is arrogance i feel like it's arrogance it could i mean i feel yeah, like it, I, I feel like you feel like it's arrogance like, oh it's not that bad whatever you feel like i feel like it's yeah arrogance. i don't know like people in oh, general okay, i feel like okay. people in general probably think that it's just arrogance or something hmm. i'm just like not worried about it I'm yeah like, oh, it's all right yeah <laughs> like oh, whatever and what if you had to describe it what would how would you describe it like your your lack of panic um i don't know it's more of a you never know like if it's the end like you don't know mm. if it's the end of the thing like you don't you don't you don't know yeah. let's just cover everything and then once we figure out everything then we're like okay it is the end like, <laughs> like we should be worried ah <laughs> 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 oh, fuck <laughs> I'm, fucking, I'm, I'm fucking um i'm about to die yeah and worry am I, like am i though yeah worry you is a weird that? thing too because right. worry i only worry when there's like i know for sure like we can't do anything about it and then it's like, is it like if you know, shit, my fucking iPad didn't work. Well, I have one. Like, do you want to just use my? Like, it's just uh, literally <laughs> like, like for just... people listening. That's what happened. Like, the iPad wasn't charged, and I long story. I control the camera with the iPad, and I'm just like, fuck, man, fuck. Yeah, you, you guys, like yeah, that, yeah. I was pissed, dude. I get yeah, I pissed immediately. Like, I go from zero to a hundred, but I'm super nice about it. But I'm like inside. I'm fucking. I'm, yeah. I'm on ten. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you were just like, oh, I have an iPad. It's like, no, I, I don't want to use your iPad. I want my shit that I own to could. fucking work. Like, yeah, right, right. I know. I'm not at all suggesting it's a good way to yeah. be because I'm fucking always yeah. on on level 10 anxious. And you're the opposite of that. It's um, um yeah, I, I get but I get you that. get more done, though. That's yeah, the thing. That's cool. <laughs> it'd, be one, it'd be one thing if you were super zen and like your output was nothing. But right. your output is extremely high and right. you're super just like chill about everything. That's what's crazy yeah. about you. Yeah, um, I get that from Ashley, and I get that from uh, this other, the Moby homie that um, that we fuck that I work with. Yeah, uh, they always do the same shit. Everybody, actually, everybody from the crew always says the same shit because um, I usually do that. Yeah. <laughs> like I always show them the video, or um, they show me something, and I'm like, okay, like 
cool. Yeah, that's cool. If unless it's like super dope, I'm like, dude, what the fuck? Like, right. when you get that reaction, I'm assuming it's like, oh, okay, good. Yeah, I'm assuming they're like, awesome. Like, yeah. you did a good job. Yeah, but if yeah. it's not, it's like, all right. I guess in in a sense, they're like, um, all right, I gotta do better, or like, I gotta work harder, or something. yeah. Maybe it's like that. Yeah. I don't know you, who the fuck knows. You do get giddy. I've I seen. I've bad, seen though. you get <laughs> giddy. You hope what's not bad. I hope it's not bad. Like I hope they don't think, like I'm like, you know, really um, negative on their their work or whatever. Oh, I go, like me. unimpressed and shit. Yeah, I got I hope, you. That's what sucks. Like I, I feel like it's probably like that. But I think now it's to a point where they know. Yeah, if people know you, how, then, my, how I am. Yeah, yeah. But I think others will probably be like, oh, that sucks. Like, yeah, what a fucking dick. Like right. <laughs> how unimpressed he is or whatever. Right. Or if my standards are super high or whatever. Fuck. Sure. I don't know. You were going to say something I forgot. Well, no, I mean, that's how, that's a good gauge for like, I know when you're excited. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, for instance, you show me that shit that you bought today and yeah. you show me the results of uh, it yeah, and super... you're sitting here giddy. Mm. Like, and I know Dude, you're, you're so really happy. stoked about it because yeah. I, I've convincingly seen. I can see where it's going to be yes. in a few months. Dude. I know where I know where I'm heading. That's where that's where it is. Yeah, I know. I'm excited. Like you, you <laughs> literally, and that what that's what excites me because yeah. I just know you enough to know. Uh-huh. I don't know what you're gonna do with it, but I know you do. And I, no idea. Yeah. <laughs> no, just like, right. <laughs> like I have no idea. Yeah, no, I have, no, no idea. No, I, have an, I have some idea, but I'm excited to like learn like what I can do. With yeah, it, you like which is cool as fuck. You like the process. You you're you're super mm-hmm. into the process of things. That's you're why like, I like editing the most. That's dude. That's fucking. I feel like that is a that describes different people's personalities to a mm. T. You know what I'm saying? Like there's some of us who are result driven, like we just want to get to where we want to get to. Mm-hmm. And then there's those of us who enjoy the journey for I know that's like super corny, but that's really what it is. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And you do enjoy the process. But I think I think there's a direct correlation between again output. I think, I mean, if you and I were the only people in the world, say, or even the only people who made things, I think it's pretty easy to conclude enjoying the process is kind of necessary for a major output. Whereas if you're just looking to like get to where you're going, you're not going to do as much. Like that's the difference between you and Mm -hmm. I. Like I get my shit done and I get it done how I want to, but Mm -hmm. you enjoy doing it. And so Mm -hmm. therefore you're constantly doing shit. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, I'm always forcing myself to do shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think it's more. <clears throat> I think it's more of a, a. First off, it's whatever it is, whatever you're mm-hmm. doing. Um, it's uh, it's, it's either both. It could be you really enjoy making it, or you mm-hmm. really enjoy the end product. Yeah. Or. Yeah, it's either it's either pre, post, or or during or whatever. Most sure. of the time, it's during. Like I, I enjoy the during. Yeah. Um, I like the editing or whatever. But, yeah. Um, uh, I think I hate the pre <laughs> the most. Like going to the spot, going I was to say, this. What would be pre? I think, like I the think that would making arrangements. Uh, yeah, I think yeah. that I probably hate the most. I think maybe filming or during whatever mm-hmm. or taking the, sh- the photos might but take. I think taking photos would be enjoyable. Filming I think might not be because mm-hmm. you're kind of just there and you're like, all right, we get it fucking. Yeah, do it a certain way. You're saying for you, you don't enjoy yeah. filming. Okay, I got but you. I think the editing for everything, I think that's what I enjoy the most because you can make it look however you want to sure. make it look, which yeah. is fucking awesome. Photos, yeah. video, whatever the fuck. Yeah, video is yeah. mainly for me at least because mm-hmm. I could just do whatever. I could just do the most. Yeah, with so little. I it's yeah. So awesome. I I do uh, in theory. I enjoy uh-huh. that too. I just get overwhelmed, but I like that you <laughs> like it. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You're totally the guy who. If if I gave you or if you if you filmed six days worth of shit and uh-huh. then you got to go back home, uh-huh. like you're stoked that the idea. Okay, I, now yeah. I get to sit down, yeah. fucking get some coffee make, or whatever, and know, just make, like look create, at everything and then create. like yeah, yeah, piece it together. I I, I think um, I think, yeah, I think the the most is better, but I think um, I like to kind of um, challenge myself hmm. in a sense. Uh, the video I showed you earlier, yeah. that was like uh, two shots here, two shots here. That's it. Oh, shit. <laughs> so it's like two two drone shots, two uh, shots uh, exterior outside yeah. over here, two shots on the porch. That was it. Oh, shit. So I just had to like fucking, I wanted to like maneuver it to make it not look, first hmm. off, to not, not make it look um, so boring. And yeah. then second, to make this whole thing like 
happen, which yeah. is cool as fuck. I love yeah. that whole thing. So I process. So yeah, I challenge myself sometimes. Yeah. But I think most is like when you have a lot of shit, that's kind. It's good too. It's great. Sure. But you just get overwhelmed. Be, yes, exactly. If uh, when it comes right down to it, I think I would prefer trying to squeeze something out of a little bit rather mm-hmm. than like here's everything make mm-hmm. something happen because then that's just more shit yep. that i have to obsess about you know what i'm saying yep yeah have um you're kind of that way in all aspects of life huh like i wouldn't call you a minimalist i would just you're just so uh either. i have so much shit <laughs> <laughs> you do have like a, lot a lot of shit. Of stuff. You, I like a lot of stuff. You I like was your, never like that too. You like Ashley, your little knickknacks. Actually, changed me so much. She, oh yeah, in the sense that I had like nothing. Yeah. <laughs> my room had nothing. Yeah. <laughs> and then she fucking she came in. She was like, "Why don't you just buy yourself this?" And I'm like, "Okay, like yeah, yeah I should have. I fucking happened." Yeah. yeah, I know. I seen I seen your your little so I have a uh, ton of shit. <laughs> like a collection. Ton. I could pop, do pop I, yeah. whatever's. I could the uh, be uh, minimalist to to an extent yeah where my desk is free of shit or whatever sure but uh yeah i have like too much things maybe mm-hmm. if i have a studio or something i'll just have all my fucking things framed right up. yeah it's one of those things yeah. like is it that i have too many things or is it that i don't have enough places to put my things uh-huh. <laughs> you know what but i'm I, saying but I, but and what you um said um if in in that um category or whatever in that mm-hmm. regards yeah the knickknacks and stuff yeah i have a shit ton mm-hmm. but with like clothes i don't have much with fucking car I only okay have one. shoes i only have one like, so it's not like this blanket thing where yeah. i just need a lot of everything it's like yeah. i need a lot of what i like what's yep. important to me i mm-hmm. understand that mm-hmm. yeah i totally get that um <sighs> i have like three pairs of shorts and these are the these are one yeah <laughs> i was yeah i have like two <laughs> three pairs of shoes that i always use and these are one yeah like, it's just yeah yeah if i could wear a uniform i fucking i would <laughs> like just it would clear my mind so well like yo to think there's something to that man i don't know nowadays like a lot of people think of like zuckerberg or, right. or steve jobs yeah, yeah. like always the, rich, the same rich, thing rich people, yeah. yeah like there's just one less decision i have to make yep. yeah but i i have like real real world experience but i like cool shit though like this Thanos. <laughs> like i just like cool shit yeah <laughs> yeah i know dude i know i think um, i have like three pairs of shorts but i have like three cases of shirts you're right i just have a ton of shirts it shirts are easy to, to <laughs> you know what i mean especially like yo i've been full disclosure i've been paying attention more like i refuse to wear the same shirt on the podcast didn't you didn't you wear that shirt before no really I yeah i feel like you fucked, okay no i have not are you sure i'm positive okay <laughs> you have like it's good, it's like yeah i got my check i got a, a, can't wear that. a pile yeah. in my house like can't shirts i've worn uh, yeah but uh uh yeah i've been thinking about that like like, cause you can only see from here. Yeah. That's all you see is the fucking yeah. shirt. That's why I wore this one. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> dude, I fucking bought this. Is like is thirty cool bucks. It was like twenty bucks, I think, at, the, at a convention. I never seen it before. I just saw Avengers, like the last one. I haven't yeah, seen. Yeah, you it don't see it. Yeah, you Marvel seen movies. It. Yeah. I've seen like the first Iron Man, the first two. That's Iron where I, I remember you saying that, and I was like, I don't want to talk to him. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man! That's yeah. like, such a good story movie thing. Yeah. And I was into them when I was a kid. Like, I used to read the comics. So, right. I really, I was always, the, my first art was drawing. Right. And so, I used to collect comics just to, like, draw. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But other than that, like, I never really went further than that. You know what I mm-hmm. mean? And my kid's all into it. So, he's like, Dad, we got to watch Avengers Endgame. I was like, I haven't seen any of them. Fucking but, games. You know, I haven't even it. seen the beginning game. <laughs> yeah, 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 I haven't seen pre-game. I haven't seen first anything. quarter, yeah. second quarter. I'm, right. fucking, I'm clueless. Yeah. yeah. But up until it's, it's, last week, I wouldn't have even known who the fuck was on your shirt. <laughs> but I'm getting it. We, we, saw these, we saw all of them during the first quarantine or whatever. Oh, you binged them? Yeah. And then, um, yeah, we got to like fucking connect. <laughs> like the fucking the, the characters a lot sure. better. Yeah, it's bro. better to see them all in a row than sporadic. Randomly. Sure, but like well, we like saw a season just... of something. Yeah. yeah, yo, I didn't realize I watched um, at the end of Avengers Endgame. Hold on one second. What a beast of tree! I Shout out beast of tree! I know I have to make sure we're still going. <laughs> <laughs> I got here way too early, bro. LOL. Check me. Let me. Um, what time is it? Two twenty-seven. Check me. I'm going to respond to Check him. Me. L O L, all good. Fuck you, my Stay dude. Outside. I'll come get you in a sec. 
heart, smiley face. Just kidding. We're going to fucking go two hours. Fuck this fool. <laughs> Is he outside? You get I him. think so. Um, you can get him. It's fine. I'll entertain the camera. I'm oh, just, you want me to keep I'm just fucking around. <laughs> <laughs> please, please don't put that pressure on me. What? Oh, no, so he's not standing. I, I feel no so pressure from so you. So he's not sitting outside, like just wait, or standing outside waiting. I would say just go get him. I don't know if he's here. Is he here? I feel like we would see at least his legs. A fucking so big tall. figure. A big, yeah. tall, skinny figure. Yeah. It's either, either someone planted a palm tree <laughs> right in front of the fucking. <laughs> <laughs> or John, oh, that's John May's silhouette. Um, what were we talking about? We're talking about Avengers. Um, yeah. Um, Oh, at the end of Avengers, I, they did that tribute to Stan Lee. Yep. That shit was so Sick. fucking tight. Great. But that's what made me realize, like, God damn, there's a lot of motherfucking yeah. Marvel movies, bro. Did a lot. I had no I idea there was that many. Like, even, I know the main guys, mm-hmm. the Iron Man, the mm-hmm. Hulk, and all them. But then it's like, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Uh, b- b- I don't even remember. But there's a ton of them. Mm-hmm. And each one has, like, three. And I was like, yeah, that's too much, bro. It's too much. I can't. It's a lot of my time, bro. Yeah, it's just a lot to follow. Yeah, it's a lot of, uh, it's a lot. Sisters are doing it for themselves. Sisters are doing it for themselves. Sisters are doing it for themselves. There he is. There he is. He's the man. Woo! This is my buddy. Buddy John May. John May. Hey, big dog. I'm all right. Yeah? Yeah. Come up. I can't move. I'm doing Playmaker stuff. Hi, welcome back to Gadzooks Podcast. Gadzooks Podcast on the way down. Hey, I recorded a little bit for him. I just wanted to just kind of just have a little snippet for him later on when he's promoting on Instagram. It's going to be fun. Done? Good. I'm great. <laughs> Watch videos on the internet on my podcast, son? Good brother. That's what, that's what's fucking... That's what, how close we are? He's, uh, they're cleaning out the house. That's the kind of friends we are? Whoa. She's going to disrespect my whole operation? They did so much work, and I'm here. She's going to disrespect my whole operation and not even acknowledge the fact that I'm asking wow. you if you can disrespect my operation? That's insane. <laughs> insane in the brain. Cool Cypress Hill reference because you're Mexican. It's in the yeah, it's a Southgate. What's up? Southgate, what's up? Southgate, what? That's where they're from. What's up, buddy? I hope, uh, I hope, because uh, I filmed something, I hope it's good enough for a little snippet. If not, then it's fine. Don't worry you about it. You filmed something. What do you yeah, mean? don't worry about it. Just watch it later. Go on, continue. I filmed, oh, on this? Yes. You, oh, okay. Yes. So you're going to touch my things while I'm not here? That's the kind of friends we are? Mm hmm. Okay, that's fair. As long as I know. That's super that's fair. Super um, fair. I was going to say, so... Continue. <clears throat> yeah, what are we talking about? Avengers or some talking shit? talking about Avengers, uh, but it, move on. It's it fine. Yeah, fuck. It doesn't matter anymore. I don't care it's about any done. of that yeah. at all. Mm-hmm. That's just like literally me mm-hmm. just trying to stay involved and mm-hmm. like engage in the conversation. You didn't care? No, not at all. <laughs> not one bit. <laughs> <laughs> Who's, uh, whose podcast has been enjoyable to you the most of your episodes? Oh, which is your favorite? Is what I'm saying. Um, we're flipping the turn tables, turntables. I kind of just hate everything I do, cool. so it's kind of hard. To I was do hoping it. this one. <laughs> I was hoping this one. Well, there are okay, or maybe I'll, the next one. I'll I'll Not say this: none like, of them. Some of them. Some of them. I know. Right? Are more dick. natural. Some of them flow more naturally, and that just obviously comes down to like my relationship with the person. You know what I'm saying? So in that sense, like this is one of the best for sure because we're like Sweet. actual friends. Right. KP was easy. K- KP got a shit roll of the dice though because oh that's right you did one with him. I not only like does he have the face he does. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, KP. Um, but uh, there was hella people here like when he was doing it and they were like oh, talking all over. The day. It was yeah. I was it was it wasn't a good one. Oh. But um. I hate that. Sean, uh, thesis was easy. That's cool. Grease ball was real easy. Just the homies, you know what right. I mean? And then, like, that's the thing. But yo. some of them, you kind of, you never, you don't really talk to them like that. So it's nice to, to get yeah. that. Yeah. And it's like, 
I know Johns is going to be great. There's that balance. Right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. There's that balance because, like, I do want people. I mean, I'm, I'm not. I fucking don't deny nothing. I do want mm-hmm. people with names, mm-hmm. like, for exposure, obviously. Right. But I'd, I'd not, if, like, I'd, not if they're people I wouldn't talk to anyway. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But then those are, like, there's a lot more pressure with those ones because I need to keep the shit going and yeah. I'm not fucking Larry King. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I'm, I'm just trying to talk shit to my homies. But then also I've had some people, I mean, cancel, but not really cancel. Oh, okay. What I'm saying is motherfuckers just don't show up. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? And if you're the homie, I'm going to be on the horn like, yo, motherfucker, like you want to text somebody? You know what I mean? But like, I don't really, I don't know these people like that. So I just have to take that L. And then I start being mad at myself. Like, yo, you, you should just be talking to your friends anyway. Mm. You know what I mean? Like it's more enjoyable for me. Mm-hmm. And uh, it, it just makes more now. sense. Yeah, for, for now. now. Exactly. So right. so that, I'm just on some shit. I just want to talk to all my friends. Right. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. And if other people come along, great. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? But uh, You like how it's flipped it on you? What, now you're interviewing me? Yeah. Yeah. Did you I, even notice? Of course I noticed. Okay, good. Uh, it just shows. I have anxiety. I pod- notice everything. It shows, shows your podcast skills if you fucking notice. <laughs> <laughs> Once you started going like, oh, fucking, oh, fucking. Oh, oh, fi- oh, am yeah. I doing that? Yeah, am no. I fidgeting? <laughs> I just, like, once you're just like, oh, fuck. What fuck? What the fuck? This is my podcast, motherfucker. <laughs> nah, nah. I don't give a fuck. I'm, I'm an artist, bro. I'll talk about myself all day. Go on. Um, Continue, buddy. Continue. Three things. Yes. One being you. It's weird because you've been in a rap group for a long time. Right. But like you just started rapping. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So A, was it, I'm just like thinking these questions out as I say them. Was it a conscious thing? Like, okay, we're going to be a rap duo, but only I'm going to rap. Mm-hmm. And then you're going to like, not saying you didn't do anything. But like, for instance, when for I, the, when for, I for, for the, for the, um, soul providers, when you hear, yeah, when yeah. you hear it, you hear one thing, which is the voice, right? right. And you hear the beats. Those are like two things. I yes. Guess. You don't really see everything else that's fucking done with it. Which yeah. Sucks. It's sure. not like, Hey, fucking, it was beat by the, it's always beat by this. This is the rapper. Exactly. So you never see, this is what, this is done. This is done. This is done. This is done. This is right. done. This is done. So I did everything else like other than that. Well, sure. But you were also on stage. And, well, and what I mean is like the first few times I saw you guys perform, uh-huh. like I would have had to have reminded myself like, oh yeah, Buds isn't rapping. Yeah. You know what I mean? So like, fu- it's so, so funny. Which is tight Everybody said that. Everybody yeah, thinks that. Yeah. Because you're part of the show. You're engaged and you're like, right. you're ad-libbing. You're right. essentially the hype man. Right. Mm-hmm. Would you say? I mean, back then, before. See, you just did the muds thing. Like, meh, meh. like what the fuck is that? I don't mean? do. What put your fucking hands up. I don't say that. Like, oh, okay. That. So that's why saying, it's like, eh, you wouldn't call really it. Okay, so I got much you. Vibe, man. Like, yeah. I don't say, get to make some fucking noise. You know, you're I don't the, say that. that but, you know, I'm in, I'm in, in my own did. way. Yeah. I, I say it the only, the, the, the my way, I guess. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, uh, it, it was kind of a conscious thing, I guess, because we started in 2011, 2012. Okay. 2010, 2011. And started in December. Surf, they were just freestyling. I was just there with the camera taking pictures. And then Thoughtso was the one. He was like, I'm going to start producing. Like, I want to start making beats and let's start. start And then Val was like, Yeah, I'm going to start writing. Let's let's fucking make some music or whatever. And then I was like, Yeah, I'm going to get a mic. Like, (laughs) I already have a computer. There's just fucking microphone interface, whatever the fuck. And then we're good. And then that's what we got. Like, I I think in January, we got everything. We got the mic interface. We already had the computer. He had, like, a notebook. Thought so had the NPC. And then we yeah. all started doing our own things that way. Mm-hmm. And then, like, three months later, we did the mixtape. And then the, our, the, 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 the our project, I guess. Because we didn't mix it. We didn't uh, master it. That's yeah. what I mean. We didn't mix it or master it, actually. And then the first two <laughs> projects were like that. We didn't. We had no idea that we yeah. had to fucking mix and master the whole thing. Yeah, no, I feel like up. we've all been there. Yeah, because <laughs> we had because uh, we didn't know anybody like that around our circle around sure. Southgate, and we didn't know that shit existed like that. Yeah, that's dope. That's always so, dope to hear. So we yeah. had Low Life. That was the first one. We didn't mix and master it. Uh, we had Soul Cow. Didn't <laughs> didn't mix and master it. And then we had another one. Um, yeah, we had another one. I forgot. I think it was uh, Bus Stop Blues. Bus Stop Blues, that was the one that we were like, all right, this is what we're doing. We're, yeah, doing, yeah. we're doing pretty good. And then we had Ashes to Ashes. Then we had Love Notes. And then we had um, we had Soul. And then when we had Soul, um, Thought Soul was like, um, he kind of just went away for a little bit. He didn't mm-hmm. really want to produce. So we were kind of like, 
um, still mixing everything, but he didn't really want to be a part of the stuff, the, yeah. the process. So we, we, it was just only us two from then on. Okay. And then we were mixing it, ma- you know, mastered it, everything, got the scratches, everything we were, we were doing. And then around that time, we started um, kind of um, like asking around for shows. We didn't really know any of the promoters, any people that threw shows around there. Cause yeah. from, so from fucking 2011 to like... So, um, soul mm-hmm. years, we didn't do anything. We had like maybe two or three shows sure. randomly. And yeah, from pretty much from soul on, we found out that this person does this city and this person does this city and yes. this person does this city and mm-hmm. whatever. And then we have the random shows that random people throw. Yeah. And then we started, uh, yeah, I asked everybody. So I was doing all that stuff. Uh, but yeah, uh, what you were saying, um, I was doing, I was doing the graphics, the photos, the videos, sure. recording, the semi mixing, I guess. So I yeah. was doing all that stuff. And then whenever there were shows, he wanted someone with him. Because I mean, you see rap shows, you see someone fucking with him, hyping him up, whatever. Fuck. Right. So Thonza wasn't going to do it because he didn't want to do it. Um, then I was like, I want to do it. Because <laughs> I was, because I fucking wanted to. I was like, I yeah. fucking want to do it. That and totally, was, that right there sums yeah. up you in the end, kind of me, like, like what we were talking about. Like, I like, I want to do that. Yeah, like, I wanted I'd, to try I'd like it. to try that. Because I was, well, I was in a band before. I was in um, the, oh, right. the, the punk band, uh, Scott Punk Bang. What did you do in I that? I was the singer. See? <laughs> All right. Okay. But like the, the, the Scott Punk shit, it was like, um, it was fucking trippy because like, um, it was around 2012 area. Yeah. Okay. And it was uh, it was so cool, like, um, going from, like, you know, on flyers, you see your name at the bottom, small as fuck letters, not yeah. big letters, small as fuck letters. Mm-hmm. And then it was gradually Every, going fucking <laughs> yeah, bigger yeah. and bigger yep. to the top, yep. second top. I was like, fuck yeah. And like, your ego fuck with it. it. Yep. Yeah, You're yeah. like, fuck yeah. yeah. And it got in our last show, which was our fucking, my favorite show, my our best show. It was, uh, it was in October. It was like a few days before my birthday. It was in Watts. It was in some, some backyard. And <clears throat> we were second up. And the first per- the first band went up. And f- I don't know if you've been to like, uh, probably never been to Scott Punk bands or um, shows or like punk shows like that. But um, you're just making the, the Yeah. The, yeah, you're correct. Uh, <laughs> correct. the, the first, the, the first band, they usually don't get that much love. A lot of people are there because they want to get there and drink and fucking whatever um is early that, on is that exclusive to the ska scene i feel yeah, like that's no every idea. show i've but ever played I first think, i don't think so i don't think like hip-hop <laughs> no? shows are like that i don't think people show up early but like with oh, ska oh, shows i see i see, yeah. I see what you're with saying ska shows are like i want to go there because that's my like place space mm, that's my you. like i want to go there i could drink comfortably smoke comfortably sure have fun or whatever fuck so usually a lot of people show up early so the first band they didn't really um um start the pit you know mm-hmm. so there wasn't people dancing there was people in the pit nothing it was just they're all kind of scattered around it was a big yard so it was scattered around mm-hmm. and then <clears throat> it was then we were next right mm-hmm. and the, the guys were setting up and i was a singer and I was, at the time before that um there was two singers the guy that brought me in and then he was like hey you, you're experienced enough i could leave now and i was like okay so i was doing a few shows without him it was it was fun and um yeah so it was uh we were there we were setting up everybody was setting up everybody was still scattered and then <clears throat> coolest shit pimpish shit that i've ever done i was like uh we were already ready to go mm-hmm. and i was like <laughs> I'm like I'm feeling it. I'm feeling. I'm like feeling the. Yeah, I can yeah. tell. So and like, I'm waiting for so it. So I'm like, I'm, so um, we fucking setting up everything. Everything's um, going like pretty much close to being ready. Yeah. And everybody's still scattered. And I'm like, <clears throat> you know, I get on the microphone. I'm like, hey, I'm telling you guys right now, if you guys don't fucking come closer, if you guys are still spread out, we're not gonna fucking start. And I Damn. turn around, and then I'm like. I'm like, so guys, you guys ready? Everybody good, good, good. I turn her back around. Everybody's fucking right in front of me. Wow. I'm like, oh shit. Like, fuck yeah. You definitely <laughs> don't want to be the guy who says that and no one listens. I know, and right? You'd be like, uh, so do I really not play now? <laughs> but, Just kidding. We're but, still going to play, but I'm not going to be happy but about like, it. But like, the cool thing is that it was like a, um, it was a, a CD release for our, our friends. Yeah. So it was like, um, so it was like that. It was like only big people kind of, you get me? Yeah. So only big names were on that show. So we were second ones. It was like, oh, whatever. But when everybody went in, I was like, oh, shit. So then I turned around again, started per- you know, playing the first song. The first song was like a little two-minute, like, you know, it was quick. Mm-hmm. And then like 
we started, I started singing and everybody got in and I was like, oh, awesome. Like, this is great. Like, they're fucking enjoying it. And then yeah. second, third song, fourth song, I was like, fuck yeah. The people are liking it. Like, it was yeah. great. And then fifth song, and then fifth song was it. Was it. And then <laughs> the main the main guy, he comes up to the back and he's like, hey, the next band isn't showing up. You guys want to go longer? And we're like, yeah. Oh, <laughs> like, fuck yeah. Okay. Yeah, and yeah. then we started keeping going. And then we ran out of songs and we're like, shit, what do we do? And then we were like, well, we know. So we practiced. We fuck around and we did covers of bands or whatever. Sure. So we were like, okay, let's just do the, yeah. And then we started doing the covers and we were like, fuck yeah. Like, this is still fucking dope. What did, what did you cover? Uh, it was uh, like La Pobresca. It was like other bands that were in the thing. Oh, so okay, okay, okay. I covered gotcha. that. Like I in, thought you had been doing fucking nah, free bird or some shit. Nah, but, uh, Sublime. But uh, we 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 did that, and the, the cool thing was that the the drummer for the CD releases band, the that, that band, yeah, he was the timbales player. Timbales is like the little, um, uh, they're like, kind of like drums. They're like um, like bongos. No, fucking. How do I explain it? It's uh, it's like snare drums, right? Okay. But hollow kind of snare drums. Okay. So they really have a specific sound, and mm -hmm. then they had like little cowbells and little like red. It was a red and blue thing. So okay. they were like, it was like a certain sound. So he used to do that, but he became a drummer, and we had those things for the for our drummer, but he didn't. He wasn't using them. So the guy came out from the from his wherever the fuck he was. He was like, "Hey, can I play this?" And they were like, "Yeah." They were like, "Yeah." And then he started playing it, and there's so many fucking phones just like, what the fuck? He's yeah. never, he hasn't done this in years. Like, yeah, yeah. And we're just like, fuck yeah. Like, this is so awesome. <laughs> like, that's dope. That was cool as shit. Yeah. So, in that regard, <laughs> um, <laughs> so in that way, yes, yeah. uh, that's where I kind of wanted that feeling again. Sure. So, when we dropped Soul and we started doing all these shows and we lined them all up, I was like, yeah, I kind of want to start doing that with you. And then he was like, okay. And mm -hmm. then, then we started performing. And then it got to that point where everybody was like, like you rap right like and i was like no i you know yeah no. i'm i'm sure i've I even don't. asked you that before where it's just like and people thought i did which is so funny when you say that i mean obviously you hadn't rapped on record you haven't rapped you yeah. hadn't rapped on stage but like someone as into hip-hop as you are as like a lot of us are like you tell me you never wrote a rap before nope. no really nope wow nope. and so interesting and so when did you like, first of all, okay, so we, I asked you, was it a conscious thing? Like, okay, you're going to be on stage, but you're not going to rap. Was mm -hmm. it a conscious thing? Like, okay, now you're going to rap now. So go write raps and shit. It was, it was, um, so after Soul, we, um, we were still working, but we didn't have a producer. So we, I had filmed with Cookbook and LA Symphony, all that stuff. So I knew yeah. he's a producer. Um, so I asked him if he could make a few beats for us, like specifically for us. So he did. And then he gave us all these beats, like 12 beats or some shit. Yeah. Val, Val is very particular with his beats mm -hmm. and he's the main person. So whatever the fuck he wants, I don't really, yeah. I have no say. I can't be like, Hey, make, you know, make a song with this. Like, right, right, I'm not going right. to fucking do it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, so he heard all of them. He picked like four or five or six of them. And I heard the one, uh, and it's funny with cookbook. He named them all like food. <laughs> so okay. he he named this one jerk chicken oh because cookbook yeah i get it that's an adorable cookbook <laughs> so he named this one jerk chicken and yeah. um and then yeah it was funny because everybody thought i rapped but i didn't and we were at the studio at the EOTR studio and uh we were working on the thing and then i was like you know it would be cool if um if you come out in the, the album in the ep or whatever yeah and I was like, you know, it was always one of those like, man, when I start rapping, fuck, I'm going to fuck shit up, you know, yeah, like yeah, that type yeah. of shit. Yeah. And I was like, uh, and it was always like, oh, yeah, eventually I'll fucking do it and right. I'll fucking whatever. And then this time it was like, <laughs> he was like, all right, we're doing it. And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck, that sucks. <laughs> all right. <laughs> and then oh, like sucks. I heard I heard all the beats and I was like, okay, I like this one. And yeah. Because he was, because Val was very nice and he was like, whatever you, whichever one you want to do, we'll do. And I was like, okay. And then I heard that one. That was the only one that I was like, okay cool like i like that one yeah and i started and i know it was good because when i started like freestyling in my head yeah i was like okay this one's gonna be a good one and then we went to the studio went to the studio with cook and then he was there and we were like okay what can we do like you know i don't know i never wrote raps like that before so i don't know how other people do it but we were just yeah. like oh how do you fucking write a rap like this or how do you what's the what's the mood or what's the yeah 
And then I forgot whose uh, idea was it. Uh, I know mine was the hook or the first set of the or the ho- the hook. I know my, that was my idea. Sure. But we dropped Soulful. Soulful is the first song that I ever wrote. Um, we did. Um, we I don't know who thought of like nothing, but like we were like, let's have this song be like Seinfeld ish, like where it's like uh, nothing, like it's about nothing. Like That's you don't very like there's much one ass shit. There's fucking it's not it's about nothing because mm-hmm. like I can't categorize it like that because I just I don't. I don't know. I don't feel. I don't know. It was the first one, so I didn't really. I want to talk about love. I don't want to talk about fucking underground hip hop. Like yeah. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> yeah. Like I can't. Yeah, yeah. I can't do my mind. My mind didn't like. I can't sure. do it. Yeah. So we were like, oh, nothing. Like okay, there's nothing. <laughs> like like random as I'm gonna be here. I'm gonna be here. I'm gonna be everywhere. Mm-hmm. And then um, yeah, we heard we wrote the hook first. Was this song's about absolutely nothing. Nada, nil, zero, zip, nothing. Like yeah. So it was literally the hook is like fucking nothing. Yeah, and then um, yeah, the easiest way is like do the four bars, four bars, four bars. Yeah, that's the sixteen. So then we did the the first one, which is the the hey there, my name is Mighty Muds. Hi, nice to meet you. Hope you're having fun. Yeah. So like we're like, <clears throat> I was like, I want it to be like everybody's obviously gonna think he's gonna come up right because it's um because it's it's been only his voice. Mm-hmm. So when you hear the song I'm first, which is fucking funny because everybody's just like. It blew my fucking mind. Like, wait, what the fuck? Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. So it's pretty funny. Like, yeah. everybody's like, wait, what? And then heard it, and then him, and then me, and then him, and then Hook, and then me, and him. Yeah. I was so, like, yo, these motherfuckers, this is a rap group. Yeah. Yeah. It's so funny, though, how yeah. how it was always, like, Soul Providers, and it was always just him. Like, yeah. <laughs> it was always just me, kind of, like, behind the scenes. For sure. Or, like, on the... um on stage with them or whatever. Yeah. And it, like, for some... It was cool as fuck, because it's, like, it made it to a point where, like... Everybody thought like I did it, which is great. Yeah. Um, everybody thought that I'd performed with him. Or I guess I was just so with him so much that people started thinking, like, oh no, you rap. You fucking rap. Right, like, right. But like, nah, I never I never tried, never did anything before. I, that, was, that was the first song that we did. Since then, um, I think I'm on like five songs of the next one. Oh, okay. So that's kind of cool. Yeah. Do you, it, I mean, I kind of answered it. I was going to ask, is that something you want to do more? Like, yeah. I like, do. is it gonna be a must win <laughs> solo album or some I shit dropping? I don't, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Yeah. I don't because I don't want to. Um, I don't know how to explain it, but it's like I feel like I'm stepping on his toes if I do mm. that. I, I don't want to do that. I feel weird about it. Interesting. I feel I don't want to be like, all right, I'm gonna do this. Like after you just showed me everything, I'm gonna do this. Like it's just hmm. I don't feel like that should. You're be, not comfortable with it. Yeah, no. Nah. I got you. Yeah, I want him there every step of the way. If we do a song, I want him on it. You get me? I do. Or if I were to like other people have asked me, like, hey, let's do a song. I'm like, no, I don't, no, I don't want to. I'll ask you this: to do a song, yes, let's do it. Don't be inviting yourself bro, onto I my shit. Want you to, I just want you to record more. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you this though, because I asked you if you if if rapping is something you want to do more, and you said you don't know. And then, at least the reason you cited was you don't want to step on his toes. So, with that having been said, assume he's not like just pretend he don't exist. Uh huh. Would you rap? No. Okay. Well, that's uh, that's all I have to. <laughs> pro- no. Well, thanks for being here. No, I don't think so. Um, so you don't, you have no desire to rap solo no. by yourself? No. Nope. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Never. Th- th- when you said it, you know, obviously when you think about it, you have to think about the question. No, I, yeah. I don't. I have no desire to do it. If yeah. it was if it was just me solo, no. Okay. I have the ideas though. Like if I could fucking do it and like picture myself and being this type of person, like, nah, I just don't, I don't picture the vibe, the style, the thing, the, sure. the cover art, and nothing. I picture nothing. Like yeah. picture for me and Zachary, yeah. Me and Val, yeah. Yeah. I have everything in my vision. Like and he's so dope though. He's just like, yeah, do whatever the fuck you want. Mm-hmm. I'm like you. You're like me. We fucking know each other. Yeah, at this point. Everything is his, everything is mine. There's that trust at this point that yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So it's like that. It's like we're doing music with him. It's like, you know, we're yeah. we're one, I guess. Yeah. Because we know each other so well that Everything he likes, I like. Everything he makes, I make. Um, I like everything I, I make. He likes. Mm-hmm. So it's just, it works. Yeah. yeah. So I don't think I would do that if if he if he stops, I'll stop. If yeah. He keeps going, I'll keep going. Like hmm. just... Interesting. I got to ask him how he feels about all that. <laughs> um, 
something that fascinates me is people's writing process. Right. Because you said earlier that you heard the beat and you yeah. you said you freestyled it in your mind. Yeah. What does that mean? Like, does that, are you saying I'll, words? It's so, it's or so stupid. Yeah, mine it's is so stupid. probably st- not stupid. My, my, cause I, cause the thing is, I don't know how other people do it. So this mm-hmm. is new to me still. That's why I'm fast. Yeah. Like, that's why so, there's not many people like you, you. So I'd like to know. Yeah. So if, yeah. if, for me, in my sense, when I hear the beat, I, I have to, you know, like it. If I don't like it, then I'll just skip it. Sure. First, first five seconds, I'll know if I like it or not. Same. Um, second would be if I rap to it or freestyle to it. I won't freestyle in a sense, mm-hmm. but I will like every punchline word. I would say it. You get me? Yeah, I do. So I would hear the thing. So I'd be like, I knew like, you were gonna say. That. Yeah, yeah so I that's what I do. About that. So that's yeah, what I do. That's how I do it. Oh, okay, cool. See, like, and that's why like, I said it's okay, probably yeah. not stupid. Well, okay. it might be stupid. Right. It's just not uncommon. <laughs> that's what I'm yeah, saying. You know what I'm saying? Not, yeah, I don't know I've, how other people do it though. I don't know how free. I don't know how people freestyle. I have not. You know, I can only tell other you person, right now. Yeah, the only other person that I've heard that I the first time that I heard, you don't have to freestyle to like to be in a rapper and artist was yeah. fucking john over here Uh-oh. that was the first time i ever heard that before and i was yeah. just like that was the only time that I ever felt like i can't rap because i don't know how to freestyle yeah and then once i heard him say it, i was like bullshit. yeah oh, okay i guess i can do that if i don't know how to freestyle yo straight up fuck anyone who says you can't be a rapper because you can't freestyle <laughs> you can you can yeah. just rap you can't be a freestyler if yeah. you can't freestyle. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's the saying you can't fucking be a basketball player if yeah. you can't dunk or some shit. That's a rid- yeah. Ridic- that's a ridiculous ass statement. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I, but I think that was probably my first um um not first, but I think that was like my biggest reason not to. Mm. I, I got think you. that's what like held me back. I was like, sure. I can't freestyle, I can't do it. Yeah. Can't do it. Which makes me think I like I wonder how many great rappers are out there that we'll never know about that they don't even know they're great rappers because this right. shit that they've been poisoned with yeah you know what i mean by the the hip-hop elitists mm-hmm. you know what i mean mm-hmm. i don't know um but yeah uh, and that's 99 percent of the reason i even asked you because i just knowing you as yeah. well as i do yeah. i had a feeling that's and really even um even if i didn't know you that first verse i heard that mm-hmm. you guys put out it's all you're big on delivery mm. you know what i mean which isn't to say the lyrics are have. lacking but you it's all steez and i tend right. to i i fuck with steez more than lyrics myself I, I told i told vile this i was like i don't think i'll ever um write like a whole story like how he does it mm-hmm. like um in a sense of like um he could tell this whole thing whole story Visual, like this means this this means this sure. this means this. mine is more like i'm gonna walk down the street and i'm gonna walk to this beat and i'm fucking, like, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Like, you fucking it's fun though yeah. yeah it's fun to listen like, to the, i'm so like it's so funny because like if you hear the album or whatever the new one um his is like fucking deep as fuck and then you hear mine and like eh, but, 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 but. like it's just like oh god fuck I, I almost said it says like fuck man that sucks i gotta like drag him down but then he likes i like him doing it because He's so used to doing this one, and it's just like, no, it's like it's cool to like kind of kick back and fuck around. Yes. Yeah. So I like doing that with him. It was mm-hmm. pretty fun. Uh, yo, I think that's but yeah. I, I don't think, think that's ever, awesome. I don't think I'll ever do like the deep meaning fucking music. Yeah. I think yeah. they're always gonna be like fun because all the ones that I'm on are all fun. They're all yeah dumbass raps. <laughs> that's tight though, dude. Yeah. That's your personality. That's that's yeah dope as fuck to me. It's like it's weird because if you if anyone asked me like how would you think Muds if Muds rap like mm-hmm. what would his verse sound like that's mm-hmm. more or less exactly what I expected mm-hmm. you know what I mean but even that with that said like I was still impressed mm-hmm. you know what I mean you you just strike me as someone who's listened to rap forever I did yeah what yeah you? you've always listened to rap yeah yeah good rap but it's too. always it's 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 um which I'm sorry to cut you off which isn't at all to suggest that people. That everyone who listens to rap their whole life are good rappers. Uh-huh. Right? There's uh-huh. clear evidence of that. You know what I it's, mean? But it's it, cool when it does work. It's crazy um, to hear um, that people like it, and then it's crazy. It's crazier to hear why they like it, and they're all in unison. Like the delivery, like the way you say this, and the whatever the fuck, right? Yeah. You know, the, the 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 way the, the the way you deliver was the first one, and I was like, oh, that's awesome. But I guess it's just like me kind of going over and over and over. And you can say the you can write the words however the fuck you want. Sure. But as long as you like, if you do it over and over again, you might cut out this word, or you might shorten yes. this one, or you might extend this one, you might whatever the fuck. Yes. So I think that's the funner part, fun part 
to do. In that sense, dude, uh-huh. to take it back to what we were talking about earlier, how you enjoy the process more than uh-huh. that. Writing music, right. writing lyrics, that's the only thing where I relate oh, yeah, to that. I enjoy the process of it. I like performing and shit. Mm-hmm. I hate recording. I'm, I hate hearing myself on mm-hmm. record or whatever, mm-hmm. but like I enjoy sitting there and like just fucking listening to the beat over mm-hmm. and over. And I might, I might repeat, like no bullshit, mm-hmm. I might repeat the the first four lines yeah for a month mm-hmm. you know what i mean just constantly repeating constantly repeating and then you're in the shower one day and like mm-hmm. oh that's where i go Clicks with it in, yeah. and you just have one more line mm-hmm. but then that might open a door mm-hmm. and then before you know fucking everything just pours out i've mm-hmm. never been that dude i can't write a song mm-hmm. i can't sit down and write a song yeah. like like that's crazy to me you know what i mean it's um it's uh for me it's like um i I can go two days, like yeah. one, two, three songs, like mm. back to back to back to back. And then boom, fucking two months and I don't fucking try. Nothing. Yeah. yeah I have I'm like that way same, as well. Same thing as last time. Like last time uh, we were scheduled to do this tour and like um, uh, just finish the album. Mm-hmm. And then in March <laughs> and then all that shit happened. And yeah. We just stopped, stopped, stopped meeting up. Couldn't do any of the recording. Couldn't do any of the stuff. So we just halted everything. Yeah. So then we have a bunch of beats, and it just I wrote we I think we wrote like two songs in like a day, and I was like awesome. And then like haven't tried or even thought about writing sure. since then. Yeah, I, there's a weird thing, man, and I think uh, occasionally, like I've heard several people say something to that effect. Where and I think. There's a difference between motivation and inspiration, right? And sometimes you're inspired, but for what I'll speak for myself, you know, maybe people can really, maybe they can't, but sometimes you're inspired, like you got a good idea, thing, but you're not motivated. And there's a mm-hmm. bunch of factors that play into why you might not be motivated. Other times you're super motivated, mm-hmm. but you sit down. So you motivated yourself to sit down. Okay, I'm going to get something done. But then the inspiration just ain't coming. Mm-hmm. Other times... I've had, I've they just so those much. fucking stars just seem to align and you're mm-hmm. like yo i'm inspired as fuck yeah. and i'm motivated as fuck blinders on just yeah. like unintentionally yeah. nothing else in my life matters right. except for what the fuck i'm doing right now and that's when magic happens i don't give a I fuck think that's how it at works. that point dude i don't give a fuck about what anyone feels about it or whatever yeah. i'm just like so stoked i Exactly I how to, you said it was exactly how the the vlogs came about. Exactly, exactly what you just said. And I think furthermore, I think it's important a to acknowledge that, but then you have to like keep your feelers on. So it's like, how am I feeling? I'm I'm real good at like I will not say I'm good, but I've gotten better at like taking inventory, kind of on a day to day basis. Like, okay, how am I feeling? Okay, I'm feeling inspired mm-hmm. and I'm motivated. Cool. Like, don't waste that feeling. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Because that shit, for in my case, it don't come around often. Mm-hmm. But like when mm-hmm. I, when that, when 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 the universe shines its light on me, I'm like, all right, right now. I don't know if it's gonna last for an hour or a month, but like for right now, like we're taking advantage and we're gonna get as much as we can done. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, I. Brittany Howard is this singer from uh, this group, the Alabama Shakes, and I got to be in the room when she was being interviewed and she said, I'm the way she said it was, I'm grateful for every song that I receive. But she said it so nonchalantly where it's like, I can see a lot of douchebags saying that, you know what I'm saying? But she didn't really mean it in like a douchebaggy way. She was like essentially just saying it's so hard to be inspired that when that moment does, when something clicks, she's like grateful for any song she receives. Like it's an external thing that comes into you. I, I've, when she said that, I was like, yo, I know exactly what that, what that is, but I never would have put it that way. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's interesting to know that you kind of feel the same way. Are you guys doing burger buddies still? Um, no, not right now. Just because, um, Oh yeah. Ra- you kind of need a restaurant. For- yeah. You need the restaurant. Um, you need to be fucking next to each other. <laughs> <laughs> fuck up. You need to, some you, fucking, need, you yeah. can't eat with a mask on. But like, even the then, things. like I was just like this whole, since the fucking quarantine happened, I really, this is my, this is, honestly, this is my first time, uh, really out, I guess. I've yeah, been yeah. filming. I think I filmed like three times. Yeah. But like, this is the first time I'm like out and I feel like, okay. Mm-hmm. So, uh, eventually, okay, what do you mean? Okay, like comfortable, like, fun, like yeah. Not, okay, I got I feel you. Comfortable. Uh, w- was there? I, was there? Was this not, what? What happened? Because I know we were trying to do this, and you weren't like it just wasn't going to work out. But then, 
we were talking about doing this over Zoom, which uh-huh. I wasn't super stoked about. Uh-huh. But I was like, fuck it, man. Yeah, as I was well. kind of upset that you brought it up like that. I was like, oh, man, <laughs> I don't get to experience the fucking table. <laughs> The I fucking mean, look in your eyes, the lights and shit. You didn't have to be all muds one about it. You could have just been like, no, nah, I don't want to do that. And I'm like, okay, fuck. cool. Me neither. So I was more doing it you for exa- you. You seem excited. I was like, all right, I guess we'll do that. That's well, because cool. I, I wasn't just going to could... do some bullshit Zoom because I know you, enough, like you're the only one of the only people that could do it, could do it the way yeah. I wanted to do it. You're right. I'd have to explain to uh, other yeah. people like, this you know what I mean? I wanted each of us on a mic yep. on our on yep. our ends yep. you record your voice i record mine you mm-hmm. send me yours you know what i mean you have the same camera i do so we can film so it uh-huh. look real dope the only thing zoom is being used for is so we could hear each other talk right, right, you know right, what i right, mean right, but right, right. The, i fucking hate podcasts when they have zoom I, I won't listen to it it sounds like shit you know what i'm saying true so true true, true so true. i don't want people to think i was going to be on some like like crack a jackass zoom shit nah 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 bro. no way so in that regard, I thought it was going to be cool. But, you know, you didn't share the sentiment. So fuck me. You know? Yeah, but um, yeah, I'm happy to be here. Yeah. I'm I'm, uh, yeah. Still excited. I'm happy you decided. What, what the fuck, why'd you bring that up? Fuck, I forgot. I don't know. <laughs> You're so gonna say this, something? this is the first time you've been at your house or whatever? Yeah. Well, it fucking has been. It has been. <clears throat> burger buddies. Burger buddies. That's right. Yeah. Um, Yeah, he had this whole thing. Like, oh, zoom it. And I was like, no. Oh, he also yeah. did. This. <laughs> no. Yeah. Because it's just like, that. how the fuck are you? I'm no. going to eat a burger over Zoom. Yeah, just thought that's not going to work. Yeah. Um, so if you guys don't know, uh, Burger Buddies is a show um, that I thought up of. Uh, first, what The first show was going to be uh, tacos. It was going to be ta- it was gonna be Mad Max, and he was going to be just eating tacos everywhere. Mm-hmm. And uh, he was going to be like, oh, let's go eat at this spot, this fucking taco spot or whatever the fuck. Yeah. So everybody has a taco spot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but um, for whatever reason, we just couldn't do it. Um, I was at the house and I was just like, fuck, I wanna really want to do that type of shit. Like, um, really want to do that type of shit. Yeah. Um, I don't want to do tacos because I'm not really a, ba- a fan of like, oh shit, you know, the, the stuff they put in tacos. <laughs> <laughs> some, of, some of the time. I can't eat like, I can't eat onions and cilantro, all that stuff that they put in. I can't. I just, I don't want to. It's not that I don't like tacos. It's just that I don't, I don't fuck with the stuff they put in tacos. So <laughs> no, I get it. I was like, fuck, I like burgers. <laughs> Let's do burgers. Yeah. And I was like, who fucking could do the burger? And I was like, fuck, Hollow likes burgers. Let's do Hollow. Um, Let's do Hollow. I called him right away and I was like, what's up? Let's fucking, I have this idea. It's for like tacos, but it's not tacos. Um, yeah. It's, uh, it's for burgers. I don't know what we'd call it, but it's fucking, you know, for burgers. And then, uh, yeah, I think we'd fucking randomly say, oh, Burger Buddies. Because it's the fucking, <laughs> like the most simplest shit. And but then, it fucking suits you both yeah. perfectly. Because we're fucking, um, yeah, we're just friends. Yeah. <laughs> we're buddies <laughs> like that. But yeah, uh, uh, yeah we just started, uh, we started and we had it all ready like we filmed all the episodes and we were just i was just knocking them all out when i could mm-hmm. and it's just it's 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 fucking dumb as shit <laughs> like it's just like stupid it's like, fucking cool it's like, entertaining we just, as shit we just get the point of burger buddies is for us to like find out which, where's the best burger mm-hmm. like that's it and i'm sure you're like fuck i only want a burger today like where the fuck do i go to get the best one yeah so that's where we that's where we come in yeah we fucking <laughs> we oh, try them out it's perfect it's not too long you get the food yeah. aspect there's yeah. a little comedy in there yeah. it's dope yeah so uh but we, it's very diy too but yeah. in a cool way we've been to 14 places Damn. 14 places so far yeah uh but there was this there was a um first first season was all 10 which is great love the love the love those episodes because we got to experience like everywhere in la pretty much yeah and uh, we went to like the big ones the big big d's burgers uh next burger in uh, whittier uh zogo's burgers in southgate went to the spot in san diego uh hodet in san diego okay went to um uh burger grub uh grubs Grub, Grub Burgers, Grub City, Grub Burgers. That's what we went to. I'm getting the yeah. feeling you don't know what it's called, and Grub you're just burgers. putting words together, hoping you land on the right. It was Grub Burgers. Um, and then the next season, we couldn't. Um, we did it so sporadically for the mm. second season. Uh, we filmed it in like February, August, July, October. Yeah, I don't know why. I think um, we just couldn't. Um, we didn't have the money. I think we didn't have that money to to yeah. try to do it and schedules. And um, so we did the four episodes uh, for season two. Um, I did all. I edited them all. We knocked them all out. We just dropped them recently, and 
<laughs> we stopped. Uh, Soul Cow was the best one. Um, so far, that's the top one. I, I would suggest Soul Cow Burgers in uh, East LA. Um, that was the one that we felt like, okay, this is the this is the, the, the type of shit that the yeah. show, the the connection we were having, the the food we got, yeah. the people that were really nice. They let us in the back to like film the grill and all that stuff. It was really cool. That's tight. Um, the owner came out. He was like, oh shit, you know, nice to see you guys. Here's try this and try this. Fuck and try yeah. This. We were like, That's fuck dope. yeah, this is the best. That was the best one. Not because of that, but because the food was great. Yeah. <laughs> uh, then we had we went to we went to Europe last year and mm -hmm. we had, we fucking did one in Europe. Oh dope. Yeah, that was I didn't really know that. cool. Uh, okay we had uh burger city no Bur yeah burger city grill in downey is that the one with uh, the mac and cheese in the burger no oh that was the worst that was the worst one we just didn't like it oh. um but the one that you're talking about the um it was called it was in long beach and it was called fuck i don't remember but we went to Long Beach. It was a uh, it was a mac and cheese burger, but not mac and cheese in the burger. It was a uh, mac and cheese as the 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 bread. How yeah. can mac and cheese be yeah. bread? <laughs> so the they like fried it. They fried the mac and cheese, and like w while we were eating it, we were just like so like disgusted <laughs> at ourselves. <laughs> we were like, "Fuck this! This is delicious! <laughs> like fuck! Why is this so delicious?" Yeah. <laughs> Like we just fuck. Uh -huh. We started eating it, and I ate it first. I ate all of it first, and I was like, "That sucks." <laughs> fuck. <laughs> like, and he was just like, after every bite, every, if thought, you watch, if you watch the episode, oh, you're fuck. just like, you're watching him eat it, and he's just like, "This fuck, this scares me," like because I could just buy this. But tomorrow. you said it sucks. That was your statement. But the, the deeper meal. we're digging into this, <laughs> I'm realizing it was didn't suck. It the was food actually was great. so good. The, the burger was so good, but yeah. it just sucks that it's just like so. A like thing. you could get it. You could buy. I could go right now and buy it. It just sucks that it's like yeah. it's it's so bad for you. Yeah, and no, we that like I understand. That's how I feel about drugs and like uh, Tylenol and shit. What? And we were like, um, <laughs> yeah, yo, I just said drugs and I saw fucking what? smoke come out. I was like, what? what is this shit? What in the world? We, what up, KP? <laughs> What's good, baby? Oh man, you're a goddamn saint. Do you drink this fool? <laughs> Every time this fool shows up with beards, he don't drink, the but that's guy. that's the kind of person he is. That face. Anyway, that uh, fucking, fucking face. so mac and cheeseburgers. Yeah, so pretty so much. So good that they're bad. Yeah, pretty much they're just so good that they're bad. I got you. you. But after that, it's funny because after the pot, after that uh, that episode, I did not talk to him for like a good two weeks. Talk to who? To Hollow. Oh. And he felt the same way. He was just like, I couldn't, I couldn't see you. <laughs> I just couldn't. <laughs> Yeah. So I could see you. Like, yeah. just go, I was just like, fuck, this is horrible. This mm -hmm. is a horrible feeling. Yeah. Because, you know, I don't know if you've ever had, like, Jack in the Box, like, late as fuck. And yes. how you ever, you, you feel I think I only shitty. eat Jack in the Box when it's late as fuck. You feel so shitty either after or the day, after, like, um, the day right after when mm -hmm. you wake up. It's just, like, you feel shitty. And that's kind of the type of uh, feeling that you were getting yeah. off the mac and cheeseburger. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I feel you. It's like when you drink too much and you try some filthy shit in bed and you don't want to talk to her for a week because you're kind of embarrassed, but also like you're wondering <laughs> if she feels the same way. You might relate to this scenario. I'm not implying you do, but I don't know. Your, your nervous laugh yeah. is telling me that you might. Yeah. Anyway. Um, nah, but it was um, it was a trip. It's funny, though, how doing those episodes because after episode after season one, everybody's like, hey, you guys, you guys got to chill. Because they saw it all in a row. So they think we just fucking ate burgers every week. Oh, every they're worried day. about your health? <laughs> yeah. We were like, no, we're fucking chilling. Yeah, like, yeah. This is funny how people were like, hey, you got to like, relax. That's funny. Work out or something. <laughs> yeah. 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 So uh, what kind of Mexican doesn't like tacos? Much one can. I love tacos. I just don't like onions. Oh. That's okay. it. That's it. Okay. I just don't like onions. So like, okay. I mean, I don't understand that either. Shut you down yeah. right away. No, I feel better. Mm. I feel better. Yeah, it's just help. I don't like okay. onions. You don't well, like with onions. Burger Buddies, uh, uh, I kind of just like um, started to let everything, however they cook it, I'll eat it. I like that because yeah. if you're gonna if you're I gonna start a burger I channel, you can't be like customizing that mm -hmm. shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I feel that. So we have that. We don't. We can uh, change anything on the burger. Uh, mm. we can't use ranch for the burger. Um, okay. And we have a few other rules, but um, what about ketchup? Can you use ketchup? Um, uh, if you want to, I guess. I, but I don't think condiments. I think condiments are just out of the 
picture. That's a, I, I like that. Yeah. Because everything tastes fucking better with ranch. But just. I agree. I like blue cheese myself, but yeah. I fuck with ranch as well. But, you know. Yeah. It's, it's just a biased thing. Yeah. So you don't fuck with onion rings. I don't. I love onions, but I don't really fuck with I onion tried rings. it this season, and I don't know how they're supposed to taste, but I know that wasn't it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, this is fucking, what the fuck is this? Yeah, fuck onion it just, rings. It just tastes, have you, have you like tried them? Onion rings? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That one tasted like too chewy. And I pictured I feel them like all crunchy. In, oh, I see what you're saying. The, I, I pictured the exterior being super crunchy. Yeah. But this this one was just super like chewy. Like yeah. How just like a regular onion would be, I guess. Yeah. But this one was like super chewy. People look at me like I'm some really fucking weird. pariah because I don't fuck with onion rings. Hmm. But it's like I like it's that I like onions. Onions are like some of my favorite shit ever. Oh, okay. I like onions so much that I'm offended by the idea mm. of an onion ring. Like, let's take one of the best things in the world <laughs> and just make it shitty just for no reason. Like, I'd rather eat a raw onion, like an apple or some shit. I haven't. So that's why I say, like, I would do that. But if I tried it, there's a good chance I wouldn't like that either. Um, it's not the best. Talk about, real quick, Yeah, you went to Evidence's house. <laughs> All right, yeah. <laughs> I remember hearing uh, um, cookbooks oh, yeah, podcast. I've been, to, I've been to a, man, if I could just fucking tell oh, yeah, you the went amount to of places that I've been Travis to. Travis Barker's house? Yeah. All kind of places. Yeah. Yeah. That was cool as fucking what? That See, was so dope, you, dude. When that you was, get giddy, yeah, I was dude, just... that fucking dude, his, bro. I fucking went through two security guards to go to that was house. Yeah, and like just going to his house, I'm like, what the fuck? And then when I got there, he was like, yeah, Kim lives right here. And I'm like, what the fuck? Who like, does Kim? Like Kim, the Kardashians? Oh, Kardashian. They fucking live like right there. I'm like, dude, oh, what shit. the fuck? He's like, yeah, I'm across the street, Master P. I'm like. Like, what the fuck? Like, this is awesome. This like, is like fuck, a whole. He's way cooler than you. Whole different I wish he fucking world. Me. Yeah. What? Whole different what world. What the fuck were you doing there? Uh, for the Travis Barker thing was. Um, I know already, but I want you to say. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Travis Barker thing was uh, my homie is his photographer. So he hit me up and he told me to come through to, to film um, the uh, Fu's birthday. His son's birthday. Uh, um, Landon. Okay. Uh, so we filmed Man, he's his on a first name basis yeah. with this motherfucker son. <laughs> so, he, son? so we filmed uh, we filmed his uh, his birthday party. All these kids rolling up, and like I didn't think about it because like you know it's just you don't think about it. But like all these little kids are rich as fuck. And, yeah, like, it's the I, only life they've known. Yeah, I saw the games kid. Oh shit! I got I saw all these like. Was I the game there? No, but oh. I saw all these like little kid, like you know, little kid faces, and I'm like, <laughs> why the fuck does he look familiar? Oh, like the actor, another yeah. actor's like, yeah. son or Interesting. daughter or whatever. Fuck. I was yeah. like, oh shit, the fuck. Um, yeah, we filmed him, uh, all his his whole party. So it was pretty, um, it was pretty cool seeing um, all these little um, things. The, the setup of his fucking birthday party was crazy, right. and um, seeing all the stuff that was there, all the 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 food, the desserts, all this stuff. But the coolest fucking part was um, I got to film Lil Pump come out, which oh. he was like right before he fucking blew the fuck up. Yeah. So it was kind of weird. Like, who the fuck is this guy? And then yeah. he played the song and I was like, oh, I fucking heard that song before. Right. And so I got to be on stage and I was like tripping out. And I was on TMZ Pictures and I was like, oh, fuck oh, yeah. Oh, shit, <laughs> where? Yeah. I was like, oh, this is cool. I didn't know that. Yeah, it was cool as fuck. But the evidence one was because of Cookbook. We uh, The first video that we did was... Uh, a whole new cook. My idea, mm -hmm. the whole idea for the whole new cook was um, taking the LA Symphony cook and introducing the new cook, the cookbook that we, we all know and love. Um, eh, no, for sure. Love. Uh, <laughs> so uh, we got the idea of using uh, my old camera, my first camera, mm -hmm. and filming that part of it, the first half of it, and having him dress old, fucking look old, like young, I mean. Uh, dress young, putting all his old young clothes, mm -hmm. young LA Symphony shirt, clothes, shoe, shoes, all this stuff, making the room look like how his room was or whatever. Yeah. Um, going to his old car. Um, and yeah, we had went to all these old school fucking LA places and used the fish eye, like the old school fish eye, the way music videos would be. Yeah. And then it fucking just switched to HD as fuck. And then, yeah, we were at Evidence's house. That's and. Dope. <laughs> the, the funny thing yeah, evidence is my favorite rapper you yeah know, obviously um uh we went to his house and i was like super excited but i was trying to like be sure zen about Keep it I guess. Shit together yeah but i was like fucking oh shit <laughs> like because he's dope photographer and he's a dope rapper and yeah. he's a dope producer and he does like, yeah he's dope yeah so it's like um i went to his house um 
I knew fucking how it looked like. <laughs> so I was like, shit, it's tight. And then going through the through the 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 driveway, and I was like, yeah. oh fucking Alchemist was here, filmed the video for this. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh shit. And then went through the backyard and I was like, oh, that's where those fucking squirrels eat. Oh shit. <laughs> went yeah. went through his studio and we were yeah. at a studio. And I was like, he has his fucking Grammy paper certificate just fucking folded, not even hanged up on the wall. That should, you know, like when you put like a paper right up against the yeah, wall, it's like, like the, it, it just like kind of yeah, like, yeah, dude, yeah. That, that's how we had it. I was like, what the fuck? Like, like fuck a Grammy. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah that's cool, shit. I guess. Yeah. And I was like, how the fuck did you get a Grammy? And I was like, oh, that's right, Kanye West fucking yeah. thing. And I was just like, fucking Kanye West. <laughs> but uh, yeah, looking through all his, sh- like, you know, I was there for a while and I was like, fuck, this is so crazy. Like, mm-hmm. it's fucking crazy. Yeah. It's fucking crazy just being here. Literally, like, just sitting here on his couch and I'm like, dude, what the fuck? Yeah, it's one thing to meet a motherfucker, it's yeah. another being this dude's home. That was li- crazy. Yeah, but I was, yeah, I was there. I was, yeah. I was it was a trip. Um, but yeah, the, uh, we shot photos and I was super nervous. Is he nice? Um, <laughs> Okay. He's evidence. Go ahead. He's evidence. Yeah. So he's, uh, you know, he's a certain way. Mm-hmm. I think uh, if you want, once you know him, he'll, he'll sure. uh, open up. But yeah. uh, he doesn't know me, so it's it's fine. I got you. Um, but yeah, we uh, we shot the photos and like as I'm setting up my camera, like I just felt like, oh, uh, that fucking five D, huh? Oh, on his part, so yeah. He, okay, part yeah, because he, like, he does photos. And yeah, shit. so he's like, "Oh, what's what's the lens you got on there?" And I'm just like, "I fucking forget." And I'm like, "Ah, uh, uh, um, uh, the the fucking the 24, uh, 105. Yeah, yeah, millimeter. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like I'm just like I have to fuck. Yeah, I just forget. I forgot everything. I was yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. You and fucking sh- fanned out. Yeah, I get it. And I shot the photos, and uh, photos came out cool. I wish I could do them again. That would have been great. Just a f- Fucking like but, every photo I've ever yeah, taken. Yeah. But like yeah, I shot the photo. Yeah, it was cool. cool yeah. I remember I was listening to when you did Cookbooks podcast. Right. You brought your NPC. I don't want to air uh, you, air fuck you he out said or that? nothing. I forgot. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to air you out. Did say that, huh? But you brought your NPC uh, and yeah. you're like, hey, uh, cook, do you think But he said it cookbook said it like a fucking asshole. And that was not like <laughs> that was not the way he fucking the, the way it happened. I'm I'm rather partial to the way he said it. Because I, I, like, I had my back because I had my backpack. I had my backpack in the trunk uh-huh. and I got like I opened the trunk and I got took out the backpack and he was like, You fucking brought your NPC to have him sign? Don't fucking do that. Cook's words were, you asked him, like, do you think he'd sign my NPC? And yeah. he looked at you, he's like, Muzz, if you ask him to sign your NPC, <laughs> I'm going to fucking light your car on fire. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but fuck, I was trying to get everybody to nah, fucking sign it. Nah, I get I had it. two max, I had Sage Francis, I wanted to get evidence. Yeah. It's fucking didn't get evidence, obviously. I almost made the worst joke right now, but I'm like, why don't you? Um, I might have Raka on this shit. From oh, nice. dilated, yeah, he's super cool. By nice. the way, nice. have you met him? Uh, no, I haven't. I was expecting evidence, uh-huh. but no, no, like super cool, right. super duper cool. He's from Hawaii though, so like, there's that oh, okay. common thing. Anyway, yeah, he does jujitsu and shit. Too. Yeah, I thought yeah, that would be a kind of like common thing for you too. You're a muscular I, person. I don't know. So there's a direct correlation yeah. between muscles yes. and jujitsu. Yes. Is what you're saying? Yep. Mm, I I'm gonna. Yep. You ready? Mm. There's not. <laughs> there's no correlation whatsoever. Um, you sure? All right, let's do a rapid fire. You fucking sure? Is there anything you want to promote, talk about? Um, I mean, we're all in quarantine, so really, no. You know what's cool about owning a studio? What? Why? Why? <laughs> no, I said what? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Why came from? I said, what? You want to start over? back in the audio. I said what? Should we start over? I said W H A. What? Do you know what's cool about owning a studio? You throw your beer anywhere? Yeah. Yay. Cool about You're and probably gonna pick it up later. Of course I am. <laughs> it's giving, it's it's making me anxious knowing it's sitting there. Um all right, we'll cut this part out, but I'm looking no, for No, don't fucking cut it out. Don't ever fucking tell me what to do ever. That's true, I really don't care. Okay. Um I'm looking for I fuck, I haven't done one of these in a while. I know. That's kinda great. <laughs> That's kinda great? Yeah, you fucking don't do any. You don't prep. <laughs> it's like you don't prep for me. That's fucked up. I mean, it's good. I don't yo, get a condom. If, I just get the raw version. That's fucked up. 
That's true, though. That is the best version. <laughs> <laughs> More terrible jokes I will refrain from making right now. Hold on. I right, stopped making sound effects. Just kidding. You can keep doing that. Um, so, rapid fire. You you know how this goes. Do you prefer black people or women? <laughs> Just kidding. Fuck? I'm kidding. That's not. That's not. That's not real. You can tell me off record, <laughs> off air. You can tell me. Just kidding. Uh, do you prefer rain or sunshine? Uh, rain. You prefer rain? Yes. That doesn't blow my mind at all. Uh, I was going to ask you if you'd like a sauna or a steam room, but I have a feeling you've been in neither. Am I correct? Yes. Okay, cool. Uh, what's scarier, snakes or spiders? Snakes. Snakes. Scarier. Yes. Are you scared of spiders at all? Yeah. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I don't. I'm not near them. <laughs> I don't put myself but if near you were. them. I, yeah. I mean, it's a fucking spider. <laughs> Depends what fucking spider you have. I mean, if I see a little long leg, what is long legs? Long so legs? Mud's one's answer to ones? "Are you afraid of spiders?" is I yeah. quote. Yeah, I guess. It depends on what fucking spider you have. <laughs> yes. Okay. Cool. We depends should make on a what T-shirt. Spider has. Yeah. What spider you have? Uh, what's an artist or an album people might be surprised to know you love? Artist or album? Yeah. Um, Dance Gavin Dance, the newest one. Okay. Yeah. I don't even know what that is. Tight. Yeah, I forgot the name of it, but it's that's all good. the newest. One. Oh, that's the band or the Dance artist Gavin name? Dance? Yes. Oh, okay. What kind of music is it? That's some Coachella I don't shit. Know. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have like a, I have no idea. Alternative, like, alternative rock, rock. Okay. Okay. Scream stuff. I have no idea. What would like, you say? What would you say that? What would that be? Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, would like, know. Yeah, I know. I was like, yeah, I forgot we got fucking yeah. allmusic.com in the, in the building. That, I don't know, Queen, <laughs> Queen, Queen would probably be the next one. I don't know. What's that? Queen would probably. Queen. Be the I fuck one. with Queen. Okay. Yeah. Um, if I gave you a round trip ticket to anywhere in the world, where would it be? Uh, Amsterdam. Mm, you've been there, have yes. you not? Oh, cool. Yes. So you want to go back? Yeah. So it's dope. I'm assuming. Yeah. Yeah, we were only there for like a sh like a day. It's so the worst, we were, right? Yeah, but like we were there for for a day, and we were there for like one of our last days of okay. like a ten of like a twelve day trip. So yeah. we were already fucking tired. So I got you. I didn't like want to wake up and you know, I like, experienced there for like I don't know five hours. Mm. Do you smoke weed there? I know you don't smoke weed. Nope. I don't either. No. Nope. So, okay. No drugs. No mushrooms. No nothing. Everyone and I. Everyone's been like, there? Been I've been not, there. dude. I've I almost went. I've, I've been there for one like, one thing. Uh, yeah. One one. Uh, one story that I really like is mm -hmm. um, yeah, do it. when I was there, um, we all walked around uh, through this little, like, I don't know how to explain it. It looks like a fucking, uh, just like a line of water. And there's just like, you know, layers of mm -hmm. streets. So we were walking through the streets <clears throat> and we see Anne Frank's house. Mm. Did not know that she fucking that was her house. That was where she stayed. Yeah, and I was there, and I was in the front of it, and I like tried to make it very like I'm here, mm -hmm. like type of moment. Everybody's fucking talking or whatever. Fuck, they're all they just like took mushrooms or whatever the fuck they're called. Uh, what is it? Space? Some shit? Some whatever. Um, they all took that type of shit, right? I, and, I have no idea what type of yeah, shit you're talking about. What do you mean? They, they all took like um, I don't know. It's called something space or some shit. Like, I forgot. I don't remember. But any idea? <laughs> No, they're like space. I don't know what they call it. I, th I know they're mushrooms, but they're called something else over there. So they're, no, I think they're called like space something or some shit like that. I forget. Yeah, I don't know. But they they just took it or whatever, and they were just kind of just mumbling to themselves. And um, yeah, I was there in front of it. I saw the little plaque that said Anne Frank's house. Wow. And then I like I I like I closed my eyes and I was just like tried to just drown them out, and all I heard was. Like the wind, right? And then all of a sudden, you just hear because they're like the steps. The people are walking on the like the the fucking um, right by the water where mm -hmm. the the like bricks, I guess. Yeah, uh, they're just walking. So you hear every walking, every everybody walking. <laughs> so just imagine her up there, quiet as fuck, and all you hear is just like the steps, and you hear everybody's steps, and knowing that you can't say a fucking word. It's such a trip. That's so fucking trippy, like just being there, being in that zone, being in, in Amsterdam and just picturing it fucking 60, 80 years ago. It's, it's fucking crazy. 
Um, you, ex- <laughs> you experienced. You thought it was gonna be something fucking funny. No, Fuck no. no. no I, I, I do. It was so no, serious. I get it. It was so beautiful. Yeah. I love that no, fucking moment. I get moment. it. I get love it. Love that moment. No, I like that. Then going to fucking red light district and seeing all these fucking prostitutes. <laughs> that's what you thought. Fuck no, bro. <laughs> that's in fact exactly what I nah, thought. Nah, bro. Yeah. And Frank's house. <laughs> yeah. Two blocks away from the prostitutes. Have you seen Helen Keller's house? No. Neither has she. Boom. <laughs> because she was blind. You get it? I, I just it. made that up right now. Because I. I'm it. fucking brilliant. I get uh, it. What's something you'd like to try that you haven't yet? Probably nothing, because you fucking do everything. <laughs> but <laughs> if there's one thing you'd like to try that you haven't yet, anything. I don't know. All right. Uh, know. W- would you rather die at the end of this year? Oh, no. That's, it's, it's already. No. When I, <laughs> <laughs> no. When I wrote that, it was in January. So we'll give you a whole year. Would you rather die in one year or uh-huh. the ne- or live for the next 500 years? You can't die for 500 years. Would I age? Yes. Ah, uh, that's fucked up. <laughs> I guess that one. <laughs> I that's guess one? that one. That fucking, one? I, I, I don't die. Yeah. All right. I don't know. Who knows? They might fucking develop some shit where I could switch bodies. Switch your body. Switch to your body. You I'll get you so body. fat. I love it. I fucking love it. <laughs> Seeing you all muscular and then going like, you know what? I can't eat this donut. Until, Fuck it. Until you realize how cool it is to look like this. You're like, I think I'm going to stay like this. I'm just kidding. I'd, fucking, of, I'd fucking I'm grow your hair out. <laughs> yeah. I'd fucking, fucking eat a bunch. I'd fucking love it. Go to go to Hawaii and be like, what's up, guys? <laughs> and oh, be, how dare you? <laughs> That be looked at like what the fuck? <laughs> Love it. All yeah, right. who knows? Who the fuck knows? Yeah, five, that's five hundred years sounds cool. I was gonna do one more, but because you are who you are, I'm gonna ask you this: If I gave you ten grand that you had to spend on photo video equipment, uh-huh. what would you buy? What would I buy? Yes, with the ten grand. Um, I don't know. Fuck, I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't buy any camera stuff. I think. Well, but like that's the condition you have to. I have to buy camera stuff. Yes. Well, what else would you buy? Now I'm curious. I don't like a studio. Fucking knickknacks for your studio, bedroom. Probably studio for <laughs> shit. I don't know. I like my setup now, so I really can't. I don't know. I can't. I, you know, I don't really look at shit like to buy. I mm-hmm. usually look at stuff when I need it. You get me? Yeah. Like if I don't need a camera, I'm not going to look for a camera. Mm-hmm. So if, if I don't need a camera, I'm not going to look for it. I don't know. If I you, need one, then I'll fucking look for it. And I'll you be like, do right, text me the all the time asking me <laughs> what I recommend. I need lenses. I yeah. need lenses. That's okay, what I need. What, okay. You can well, buy lenses, any lenses you want. Uh, 20, you the, 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 any G Master right now, the 1635 is pretty good. The, the 2470 was also good. Those are the ones I'm looking at, and I don't know which one to get yet. Mm-hmm. So, um, so yeah, I would probably just buy a fuckload of lenses. Primes? I don't know why you like primes. I I see the value of both, mm-hmm. and I don't see. Um, You're I saying don't you see, don't know why I like primes? Yeah, like okay. I don't see why um, you wouldn't like zooms because mm-hmm. you can manipulate it kind of pretty well. You get mm-hmm. I me? Mean? Yeah. So I like zooms in that way, like where I could, if I want twenty four, I'll get twenty four. If I want seventy, no, I'll I get that. Put, 20, uh, put seventy. I don't want to like have to like switch out the thing or mm-hmm. have a big ass bag of like multiple shit yeah so no i understand it it's so way I more like practical the, so i like i like zooms mm-hmm. but i also do like the like the 50 mil like mm-hmm. i love it i just yeah. love being like okay i can't be this i have to be this distance distance yeah this distance away what's your favorite focal length 50 50 i figured yeah that's tight mm-hmm. i think we had the same 50 for a while you still have that the canon one four no one two Oh, oh, oh! You, I like how you just said that all national. Like, no, nah, one two. It's one two. It's only the difference of fifteen hundred dollars. One two. Some, sometimes motherfuckers have one, one four. Two. And sometimes Found it for seven hundred dollars. One yeah. two. Damn, you spent seven hundred bucks on that. That's a steal. Mm-hmm. That's tight. Yeah, I'm trying to buy that twenty four seventy. That's fucking twenty three. Twenty three hundred. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Expensive. It's a, it's an expensive <clears throat> thing. Yeah. Habit. I don't know. Career. Maybe. Vice. Yeah. Who knows. Yeah. Yeah, career is the, 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 the career is what we tell ourselves. Me. Habit is what our wives tell us. And uh, that's about it. <laughs> All right, last one. Right. Top five rappers that are alive. We Fuck know number one. You. Evidence. Uh-huh. Um, that's one. Um, the most ass. Mm. Um. 
just fucking scrolling through my Spotify. You went complete with thumb and everything. You, yeah. yeah, I get it. Slug. Okay. Fuck. I hear the birds chirping. I do too. I hear the people walking. I can't hear fucking. I can't. <laughs> can't, bro. Can't. I don't know. The fifth one's up in the air. I have no idea. That's only three. No, I said four. Fuck you. Did you? Mm-hmm. Damn, just fuck you. Fuck you for not listening. Jesus. I'm pretty sure you only fuck said you. three. Which are, the, which are the three then? Evidence, most deaf, and slug. Yeah, did I say three? Fuck, I don't remember now. <laughs> no, that's a three? Bullshit, I said four. Oh, who's the fourth one? Then? I forgot, I don't remember Well, now. then you probably only said so the, three, uh, sir. Evidence, that's one. Uh, did I say guru? I forgot no, if I said guru. Not. Guru, slug, and then I'll pick, um, which will be my sixth one. I don't know, we'll have to listen to this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I like Biggie. I, I was going to cool. wear a Biggie shirt today. That works. Yeah, I'll, yeah. Just, I'll say that. All right. Yeah, I know, like, right now, if I fucking look through my shit, I'll be like, oh, fuck. Why don't I say that one? I mean, there's no wrong answer. That's true. I mean, unless I say Gadzooks, Kanye. Gadzooks and, is pretty and, fun, too. And, and John May's in the room. Gadzooks is pretty fun, too. <laughs> cookbook is great. Fuck cookbook. Yeah. Idea I really like. I don't want people to think I hate cookbook. We just have this. No, like, you do. We, I mean, I do for sure, but I also love them. We have this like really weird intuition is really good relationship. Yeah, he is. Um, all right. Well, Mac Miller is really great. See, we, we already, you did the five. No, let's just do 10. Fuck it around. going to change my shit. Let's <laughs> 10. Fuck it. Go ahead. Fuck it. Oh, you're no, done cool. now. Yeah. I'm okay. Fine. All right. You good? You want to yeah, talk about anything else? You good? I mean, we could talk for hours and hours, but John but here, Not with your hand over your face. John can't. and KP are here, so we better we better just... Uh, no, we're on this two hours that. and ten minutes. Right, right. Yeah. 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 It's funny. I pictured um, Rafa. You know, that's just, uh, you know, I'm everywhere, so you, uh, your questions are going to be everywhere. You know, there's not they're not a single like Yeah, no, that's yeah. that's why it's easy to talk to you because you and I like we do yeah. a little bit of everything. You're getting anxious you're not you're not getting anxious, you're getting like comfortable. Me? Yes. As the more as we go along, you started very like and I think the word like, for that is drunk, but you started, <laughs> comfortable, yeah. It's you a byproduct of, of it's nice. Drunk it's nice things. though. It's nice. Cool. How it's do like, you end these? I forget. Uh you got you don't forget. You're just waiting for me to ask you to do it. <laughs> I'm like, hurry the, f- <laughs> hurry the fuck up. You are. <laughs> hurry the fuck up. I, I thought about not asking you because I know you've been looking Before forward to this part. What was this? Oh, fuck. Wait, what was this? What is this? You got to say the devil is a motherfucking lie. <sighs> oh, yeah, that's right. I was telling you I practiced it. <laughs> yeah, that's why I was like, and is, that's our show. Good devil, night, everyone. The Even devil, though it's daytime. The go ahead. The devil is a motherfucking lie. Is that, that, is that your one? Yeah. Can let's you do, do it again? That one. The devil is a motherfucking lie. That's not at all what the you The devil is a motherfucking lie. The devil. I'm going to give you like five so you can just. The devil is a motherfucking lie the devil is a mother was that a good one the devil yeah. was a motherfucking lie was or is yes is was devil is a motherfucking lie the devil might be the devil might be a motherfucking lie there's just like eight just do whatever pick do whatever. one more god damn pick it. whatever you want i don't like the devil damn. is a motherfucking lie all right yeah it's good <laughs> <laughs> my dude <laughs> You're my guy. Are you good? I feel yeah, like that's feel a weird fine. ending. No, it was what? No, it was great. We talked about everything. I don't know why you made fun of the whole pitter patter of the Anne Frank house. That was pretty great. I didn't make fun of you. No, you did. Let's go.